Wow. That music's got me pumped for farming. Morning, nerds. How y'all doing? Welcome back to uh, Farming Simulator 22. I guess they stopped calling it like 2013 or something years ago. I think they now just call them like the last two numbers of the year. Let me check here. Farming Simulator. Yeah, the last time they called it a full year was in 2013. Farming Sim 2013, and then Farming Sim 15, 17, 19, and now 22. Wow. It's been a good run. I've enjoyed the uh, Farming Simulator games a lot. Oh, I see Rick and Harry are on, too. Uh, if you boys want to join, feel free. I'm just going to get started here in a moment. Um, I never know who's going to join me on the farm anymore, but today we'll be jumping uh, between our dairy farm and our American farm, just kind of hanging out for a few hours today. Today's stream will be a little shorter than usual, like about four hours or so. I got to uh, get some uh, recordings done for the week of some other stuff that I wanted to play. And uh, tomorrow we'll have some uh, something I think you guys will enjoy. I, I don't know if I can say what it is or not, but um, there's a DLC for a game that you guys really liked recently that we're going to take a look at. And it uh, should be good times. So thanks again for Smack and Join to become a member. If you'd like to, it's a great way to support the channel. It's a great way to get something in return. Um, it's a two-way street. Memberships are awesome because you guys can uh, support the channel but also get something in return. You can also drop a super chat or uh, stuff via PayPal if you want. I don't know. If you, if you want in the description. It's all cool. All right, let's see. I'm just going to do some stuff here. We're going to reset our member goal as we have a new stream for today. And hopefully we can have ourselves yet another giveaway on the Discord. And I'll, uh, I've i been doing a good job now of finally figuring out all the other games that I have to give away now. Usually they were like jingling around in my email. I got a lot over the last month because of all these new games coming out. So my email is just flooded with like... Seriously, like I'll do a four-hour stream with you guys. And then I'll get like six new game notifications of games coming out. It's insane how many games are coming out. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Insane. Big O crazy. Million dollar. Uh, let's see. What's going on? Is the lad here? Let's see. Is Harry here? Oh, Rick's here. Well, Harry, if you want to join, come on in. Um, I think I'll go to the American farm to start, and then we'll go, we'll jump over to the dairy farm a little bit later. We're going to, we have two farms set up in the game, both of which we've been playing realistically. So we're going to go to the uh, American farm first, and then we'll go to the dairy farm. Let's call this Raptors Farm. And we'll name it... Password should be... You're just eating some food? Okay. Well, if you want to join Harry, feel, feel welcome. And that should be everything. Let's put on some chill music. That's chill. That's too, like, 8-bit. There we go. That's nice. Well, happy Monday. Uh, outdoor gaming, you are correct. That That is correct. I don't know if I can say anything about it. I can confirm that there's a DLC for that game coming, and I can confirm that tomorrow I'll be streaming, but I can't confirm whether or not it'll be that game. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Billy. Yes, it does. Hopefully, Harry is eating pizza rolls. Oh, we got to ship that lad like a... We gotta, you, you know, like, do you guys at home have uh, water softeners? If you have a water softener at home, um, oftentimes you have to buy like a, like a bag of salt. Like giant rock salt for the water softener. That's what I'm going to get Harry is like a big like throw over, like, like bags of you know, like when you're mixing cement or concrete or whatever, and you throw the, the bag over your shoulder before you throw it into the uh, mixer. That's what we're going to get him. A big old bag of pizza rolls. Oh, this still, that damn um, winter glitch. Well, I guess next month it'll probably be appropriate. All right. Uh, Rick, are you here? Am I, uh, hello? Oh. Bro, you didn't get any sleep last night. You were with us all night last night playing. Uh, uh... For three hours. Wow. Bro. How old are you again? 26? Uh, 24, yeah. <laughs> I always forget, because Rick's like... Rick's one of these dudes who has a ton of experience. I always think like Rick's in his 30s, but I know it's that's never the answer. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Alright, well, that's okay. The password is the second name in the Away channel, the usual one. I am already joining. Oh, are you? Good. Okay. Yep. 
Oh, yep, there you go. Totally not Rick is joining. I wonder who it could be. Oh, yeah, I still have a name like yeah. that. Yeah. Okay, so last Saturday we did, okay, everybody who joined us for the Saturday harvest, that was insane. The amount of, like, absolute, not even organized organization was crazy. It is, it, farming sim is something else, man, because, like, there were 16 people on the server. People were bailing. People were auto-loading bales. People were harvesting. People were using the uh, chaser bins and, like, hauling. Sound. I couldn't believe it, man. Like, I'm so proud of you, members. Oh, yeah. You guys did an amazing job. And uh, I think we got to do that again. Harry says it was sick. Yeah. I think next time we should just do, like, canola so that way we can try to get, like, eight harvesters together and maybe, like, combine all these fields. We did, um, you know, in our Saturday stream, which you guys should totally go watch, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34... Um, I think these fields down here and some of these fields like up here, it, we harvested like all the wheat. Like it was crazy. The only other thing I think we could have done is combine these fields in the corner, but even that would have been nothing for the absolute devastation that chat put, or the members put onto those fields. Like you guys, ma'am, we made enough bread to like make, uh, well, enough flour for Christmas cookies for a million years. Like it was crazy. Really cool. But anyway, so thanks to everybody who tuned into that one. That was a ton of fun, dude. That was so good. Everybody was just like on the ball. Well, uh, welcome back, everybody, to American Farms, uh, a.k.a. I guess we called it First Farm because it was the first farm we built. We've been we've been playing. God, we must be like 100 plus hours into this farm alone. We really haven't even gotten anywhere either, which is cool. Uh, cause, content farms, right? Oh, yeah, content farms. farms. Yeah, content farms. And uh, we, I feel like we've done nothing yet a ton at the same time. Which is oh, good, yeah. because, like, if you really want... You could play Farming Sim for an entire year with friends and put, like, a thousand hours just into one map and, like... I mean, I guess the real goal is to, like, buy every field on the map, but it also is to do whatever you want to do. Like, if you don't want to do potatoes at all, and there's a field that's, like, perfect for potatoes, like, and you don't want to buy it, you don't have to. Like, if it's if it's too small for wheat, but too big for anything other than potatoes or something, um, yeah. Yeah. But anyway, I think you and I... Okay, so let's take a look at our map. So we we planted every... Oh, we got all our planting done. Oh, that's right. I was with Alex last time. Mon ami. Mon ami joined. Oh. And uh, he helped oh, out. Oh, yeah. He joined as soon as I uh, left. Yeah, he, he filled in and then he... Um, so he and I just planted a bunch of the canola. What else do we have planted? So we have... Oh, yeah. 47... 44, 47, 50, and 51 are planted as wheat for the chickens, and then 48, 9, and 52 are canola for our oh, uh, nice. our yeah. uh, oil operation, and then 45, 46 is olives, and I think we're going to buy, I think the plan then is eventually to buy 55, however, the real plan should be to try to absolutely maximize our yield, which we did by, uh, I think we, did we, how, how can we tell if we did rolling, Rick? Did we Rick roll? Uh, we did rolling, I know that, but there is I don't really know. a way to tell this. Well, one of the cedars is still out in the field, so I think I ended the stream as soon as we finished that. So I think... I don't know how to tell if a field has been, like, rolled. Shouldn't it just look clean without any, uh... I don't know how to tell. Yes, Rick rolled, Oh, Rick rolled. yeah, we haven't rolled these yet. Point. Yeah, that should look clean. Is there a way to tell, like... In the vi visual filters? No, I don't think so. Okay, so you, you actually... Let me... Back oh, there. wait a minute. We did it on the canola fields because we planted that yeah. first. Yeah, so, okay, so we got to roll... So we got to roll 44 through 51 on the left side. And then it looks like there's some weeding to be done on the... Yes, 40% weeds. So the canola fields need to be uh, herbicided. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's so cool how like quickly we can forget what we were doing and then just like remember, <laughs> just kind of like yeah. working working through and remembering. Well, it was a couple of days ago. Yeah, that's true. I I, I think uh, chat. By the way, I'm gonna play a little less farming sim, but we're still gonna play it like a lot. I'm gonna probably be playing this like three or four times a week from here on out. So um, every other day we're probably gonna do farming sim, and then on the weekends we're gonna do some big O uh, harvest jobs and stuff. The last harvest was so fun, I think we'd, we we got to do it again, but maybe we'll we'll come up with some other ideas in the meantime, so we always have something fresh and new to do. So in a way, welcome back to the stream, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. Is Farming Sim 22 a grind like 19? Um, y yes, but I think that's the point of the game, I guess. Um, well, let me put it this way. There's so many things that you can do in the game to increase the yield of your fields that 
the reason why our farm is so small is that we're making a ton of money by just basically we we've cultivated and harvested these fields a few times but it's allowed us to buy a ton of equipment so we've basically kept this the farm pretty small and then we've just constantly been spending that money on new equipment and new upgrades to inc constantly increase our yields and so now at this point we're making like i don't know half a million dollars a year in like chicken eggs and then like uh you know another yeah. couple million from uh not million but a couple hundred thousand almost a million dollars between our chickens chickens are op chickens are op and broken it's awesome well not broken but they're definitely uh, very uh profitable without much effort which is why we're doing a lot more wheat on the fields the reason we want so many more wheat fields is so we can actually have more chickens because we realize that they're really good but we want to be able to feed them and the best way to feed them is to actually grow the crop rather than buying the bags all the time because you know each bag is like six thousand uh, dollars per bag and then you got to buy like two of them per month and it's just it's a lot of headache and we we want to avoid that for now well, eating your profit into your profit literally Chat, where's everybody watching from today? Give a give a big old shout out to where you're watching from. And uh, give me a one in the chat if you're uh, watching live right now. And thank you, chat, for 100 likes. Welcome to all the new members, too. Thank you very much to uh, Catalan for becoming a raptor hatchling. Thank you very much to Renee for the five months as a raptor egg. And Christopher Stevens with the three months as a little raptor saying, keep up the awesome work. I really enjoy your streams. Thank you very much, Christopher. We enjoy your company, dude. Thanks for hanging out. Thank you, thank you. Oh, oh no, I think Jade I is think a little I see Granny. Jade, thank you very much for becoming a little raptor. You see Granny? You talking about? Oh, you talking about? Yeah, yeah last night. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that game was oh, cool. That was so much fun. Only thing the game needs now is just more maps and more characters. Other than that, great oh, game. Yeah. Great game. Definitely worth twenty bucks for sure. Uh, we're talking about a game we played last night. Uh, prop night. One, one's in chat if you watched our stream last night. One's in chat if you watch every stream. If you're a big fan, bet you're not. Bet you won't. Bet you won't turn on the notification YouTuber, bell. When is the Fortnite stream? Dude, Fortnite apparently ended chapter two of Fortnite. And I'm thinking to myself, dude, chapter... Fortnite, dude. <laughs> that game died in like 28... I, like, I know millions and millions and millions and millions of people are playing it. And it's generating billions and billions and billions of dollars. But it's not like... It's not what it was. It's not like on the hearts and minds of every young teenager anymore. All right, so you're rolling, Rick, right? Yep. Okay, so don't... I'm rolling. Don't forget to do 44. What else can I do? Oh, yeah, 44. Uh, you do like spikes like back then? Oh, yeah, every once in a while I'll tell chat to, like, smash like and stuff. Uh, basically, all I'm trying to do is uh, get people to smash like for my uh, evil plan. No, it's uh, because I want to know what you guys like the Time is limited every day so i want to do the stuff that you guys like the most or play stuff that you guys haven't heard of so that way you know you're aware of something that you may have not heard of before so we play indie games that are new and we play um well we play everything under the sun just to try to test it out and see if it's fun or not you could probably do herbicides oh yeah all right And then next month we got to do herbicide again then for the wheat. Yeah. Uh, might have to change it to some of the uh, narrow tires too. Oh yeah. Uh, Cormac should already have them available in the workshop. That's right. Yep. And that would Ooh. be pollen. Lad. We're going to have to get the date updates. Yeah. All right, we'll go to the shop then and change those. Oh, dear. We'll just consider it to be a frosty morning. Poglad. Oh uh, yeah, our Poglad emote's been upgraded for Christmas now. Christmas lads. Uh, 
I see someone hasn't been paying attention while sewing. <laughs> oh, I th yeah, yeah, I think we, yeah. You're watching from Denmark? Excellent. Welcome aboard. Thanks for watching. Uh, I think Harry is not going to recognize most of the equipment we currently have already. Yeah, we certainly do have a lot of new equipment. Do I have to confirm it after I change? Uh, yeah. How do you confirm, though? I don't see a button for it. Um. Oh, you just, just customize. Just click enter. Okay. Yeah. I see now. You're watching from Newfoundland. Well, thanks for watching. When is Parklet uh, going to join us in this week? <laughs> Hopefully soon. He's eating, so maybe he learned his lesson from the last 14 times. Let's take a look at the fields. So we've got, uh, oh, the one field, two. 52, yeah. You know, I feel like this big sprayer is maybe too much for these fields. Wait, do we have any contracts? Oh, I don't know, actually. Oh, we do. We have a fertilizer for 9,000. Oh. Well, and this has herbicide on it anyway, so I need to uh, go get that instead. Well, that's what I'll do. I'll have Poglad take this tractor and put her herbicide in it so he can do a $9,000 contract. So, Lad, if you could... Poglad, do you want to jump in the uh, McCormick and uh, put fertilizer in it and then go do a $9,000 job? And I will uh, do the smaller side. Oh, you're doing water? Okay. Well, we got all day. Uh, Farming Sim 22 Pro Farmer with the 5 Canadian. Thank you very much. That's a nice looking uh, little fox there. Thank you very much for the support. All right, we want the something with narrow tires. I think the John Deere you can probably put narrow tires on. We have uh, a hay bale tractor here. Didn't we sell that? Uh, I think January was the best price for the bales. Oh, we're holding on to them. Okay. Yeah. Wow, Poglad not even going out to one of the water sources and using from the tank. Oh, my God. Costing us money again. <laughs> This boy is going to cost us a fortune. Southampton's watching as well. Thank you very much for tuning in. Do I still play farming sim? Oh, only subscribers? No. You can find more about that on the channel. Well, oh, it's going to cost us a thousand for narrow tires for the John Deere. Yeah, one time though. Yeah, that's fine. I'm alright with that. Because honestly, now we're so busy on the farm that everybody gets to do some, some big jobs. I'll let Poglad do the big stuff. He's good at that. Oh, a lot of Brits in the chat. A lot of other lads of Pog. The, the United Pogdom. Oh, what? What? What was that joke that you had? It was it was in Icarus, wasn't it? What? Uh, I don't know you were joking with Red with. Uh, I don't know now. Oh. I hate it when you forget funny things I say because they happen so rarely. <laughs> 
Wait, how do we fill up from a thing? Is it over there? Oh, yeah. British Halo. <laughs> oh, Halo, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. It's not Halo Infinite for the Brits, it's Halo, isn't it? Uh, it's Halo, isn't it? But he's got a Tennessee accent now. It's such a weird thing. Red doesn't seem like the... Red's an interesting character. I like him. Uh, some people take over accents easily. I'll just that. Wait, I don't... I don't remember how to fill up from a... From the fertilizer tank. Oh, wait, you uh, press R. It should R. be out front. Yeah. I, w I was just looking for, like, an on-screen prompt for it. Oh, uh, yeah. But I guess what I need to do no, is... No, we don't have set four to When it says slide. start overloading, if you need more, you just press R, and then you uh, you load up. Yeah, forgot about that. Yeah. Got it. Amen, brother. Amen, brother. All right, cool. We're ready to go. Woo. Safety beacon time, yeah. You know what? At this point, you, you know those candles, Rick, that you can buy that are like, uh, they actually have a battery in them, and they kind of like flicker? Yeah. But they, it makes that flickering that a candle does, but it's, um, you know, it's electro it's a battery, right? The the beacon, I have it, I put the beacon over on the desk now, and it's just like this warm little candle every time I turn on my beacons now. It's very comforting. Very warm. <laughs> no, chat. Oh, nice. Icarus is not a good bear sim, okay? We're supposed to play Icarus later today. I can, I can, I can turn that stream off, chat. Okay. Uh. I, I saw the early starting time. I was like, oh, I can, I can join that, and I was like, hmm, probably also should get some more sleep today. Yeah, I'm starting it earlier because I want to do, uh, I want to do some stuff between the break and, uh, well, basically, I'm trying to do some more recordings. But, oh uh, yeah, YouTube's really weird with its. Uh, the channel is getting rated really low now in the algorithm, so it's like, I don't know. I should just take a vacation. Woodwick candles are the best. I agree. I had a family member bought me a woodwick candle a couple of years ago, and I was like, dude. Like, I put it in front of, um, I have like a coffee table that's in front of my uh, fireplace, and it's quite nice. It's nice to hear that crackling. Candle or the fireplace. <laughs> Yeah, you know, because my fireplace is just like a, a gas fireplace, you know. Oh, yeah. But the woodwick candle, like, smells nice, and it gives that crackling sound effect. I love those things, dude. Woodwick candles are... And, like, the, one of the, the scents that I got, it was, like, I don't know, leather and sandalwood, so my entire place smelled like a wood shop. It was awesome. It was so good. <laughs> nice. And then there was another one that was, like, pine or whatever. It's supposed to smell like a forest, but... Yeah, guys, uh... Wait, oh, I'm using, uh, wait, I'm using, using fertilizer. I should be using a herbicide, shouldn't I? Uh-oh. Uh, yeah. Good thing I just thought of that. Wait, actually, this is growth phase one. Doesn't it need both? Or oh, does it, yeah. Or, uh, we or can wait. do both, yeah. Growth phase one so we can, um, fertilize again. Oh, damn, this field needs lime again, 52. Oh, really? Yeah. Let me do lime. Oh, we didn't look at that. Let me do uh, lime fertilization, then I'll do herbicide. I don't know if we can do lime. Oh. No, why? I think we need to do that before planting. Oh, you're right. Well, only 52 needs it. It's not going to be that big. Yeah. Well, there goes that high yield. Eh, we're working on it. It's fine. All right, so we'll do the lime next time. It's fine. Raptor likes pretty smelling candles. You're damn right. Well, not pretty. More like... Uh, I don't know, you know how guys' scents are. Everything's like leather and like wood and like sawdust and I don't know, lum lumberjack. I don't know. Raptor's pretty, that's true. Very true. Um, Alright, I'm just going to hit up the... Uh, I guess I'll do fertilizer first, then I'll just switch it to herbicide, so that'll work out. Alright. And then we'll just have to remember to do lime the next time. And then Poglag can do the herbicide. Uh, oh, no. You can do fertilization. Actually, do we have any herbicide jobs? Let's see. So we have... Oh, we have two... We have a $10,000 herbicide job, and we have a $9,000 fertilization job. So me and the lad will basically be doing the same job, just in two different spots. All right. Yeah. So that'll work out. 
Yo, what's up, uh, Ikvidalizer? Good to see you home from work. Hi, chat. If you're watching live, don't forget to smash like. It helps out the channel to grow, especially in these dire times of the Susan Suppression algorithm. Basically, if you're not, uh, if you're not Team C's or Roblox, you're just suppressed. So thanks for helping the channel to grow. Or pro YouTube videos. Yeah, I don't know, dude. Honestly, I was I was reading a comment the other day about like, uh, yeah, I complain too much. I should play games and be happy. Yeah, Poglad's here. He's in the uh, server, but he's he says that he's eating. So at this point, I've determined that that's a lie and that he's actually on the phone. <laughs> Raptor YouTube really hates me, lol. Why? What happened? It's okay to vent. Yeah, but I do it every day to you guys because honestly, I like you guys a lot and I like doing the streaming and it's very sad that YouTube plays this game where they just they just don't send out notifications ah. for people. And then hung up the phone. And then they'll write up this report saying, Oh yeah, your views are down. It's like, yeah, because you didn't send out notifications. You oh, but you should We'll send out more more uh, more notifications if you make more videos. It's like, is this the mob YouTube? That's a nice channel you have there. It'd be a shame if something were to happen to it. Fuck left. Hello. I'm not gonna vent anymore. I'm just gonna I'm gonna be happy for you folks. Mandatory happiness, as dictated by the algorithm. What's up, lad? Where were you? What were you doing? Pretzels. You were what? Pretzels. Pretzels? Yes, pretzels. Is that her name? Oh, town. <laughs> <laughs> nope, I have a date this week. With pretzels. Wow, Harry's getting more dates in the calendar. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> My god, uh, lad. Take a day do? off. Uh, if you could go to the McCormick, fill it up with... Yeah. Uh, Fertilizer or herbicide? Do two of those uh, contracts? That'd be great. Right yeah, now, I'm huh? I'm fertilizing, and I'll be doing herbis herbicide after for uh, Harry Canola. Yes, sir. How's this one called? Oh yeah, what's the next girl's name? I think I cannot release. <laughs> Still in beta uh, or what? And the one <laughs> NDA. <laughs> and the one after that? Yep, nothing. Harry, we, we do nothing but praise you. Why are you so embarrassed? We're proud of you. <laughs> Dating is not easy, especially in these times. Uh, the fact that you've got multiple dates so. is... Oh, she's 32. Wow. That's amazing. I know. What's your age? I guess. Yes, he does regret telling us about his dates <laughs> with Sophie. He does, yeah. <laughs> It's, it's, I don't know, it's weird though, because we, we do nothing but praise him. But to say so Sophie is gone. Sophie has been thrown out. Oh, wow. She's been Had eliminated. <laughs> what, was, what, was she not good enough? She was not up to par. Wow. Uh, Wait, what was wrong? What do you look for? Something I will not disclose. <laughs> oh, she only had farming sim 19, not 22. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't want to upgrade. She said that the ni 19 with mods was good enough, and Harry just immediately wasn't deleted a her number. That's why. Oh, she wasn't a Raptor Ultimate member? Yeah. I see. So, Harry, as you can see, we've been investing. You have. Yeah, we've been trying to get that yield up maximum, and damn, it's working. The yield is increasing. And we're going to add more chickens next year after our next wheat harvest. You know what the yield is like? It's almost like the YouTube algorithm. It don't tell you what to do, hmm. but you got to do something. Got to do what up. you got to do. I really, I, I really should just start streaming on Twitch just to complain about YouTube, really.
Oh, Harry, is she a watcher of this channel? Yes. That's why I can't release the name. Wait, really? Oh. Somebody in chat Ooh. said, Raptor, stop her. Don't stop herbicide to increase yield, just use the weeders. Just using but herbicide? That's not, even, that's not even the pre stages. Oh. If the, the weed is fully grown, it doesn't do anything. Uh, the weed isn't fully grown. But if we're right there. we're in stage one for the cano yeah the canola right now. I'm sure if you just weed it, it will come back anyway. Well, no, right? If you if you, if you spray herbicide, it won't come back. Oh, you oh I see. Wait, you're saying a weeding machine that'll come back, but the herbicide it won't? Yeah. Oh. The herbicide goes straight to the plant. The weeding machine just goes for the weeds. Hmm. Uh, Tim says that the guide says that herbicide reduces yield. You better check that guide, Harry. We might be getting a hot tip. It's either one or the other. Do you want weeds? Or do you want well, <laughs> if we use a weeder... But there's, it can still come back. I don't know. You have to keep doing the same thing. It's your uh, call. You can't, do, keep, you can't keep doing the weeding, though. No. Only the first growth stage. Yeah. Because otherwise it gets too tall for it. And then when it At comes back, point, you have to spray it. At some point we can actually uh, invest in a big weeder. I think the one we have is pretty good, right? Yeah, it's pretty, pretty it's alright for the farm we have. Raptor YouTube thinks my channel is confusing. Wait, what does that mean? I would like to talk to you a lot. A lot of you guys who want to start channels about YouTube advice, uh, about getting started and stuff. It's it's nice to know that some of the things that I know work. But at this point, for me, I, I don't I don't know what my next yeah yeah. So to be good at YouTube, you start on Twitch. Get 26,000 consecutive at all times, and then uh, throw in the towel and have Susan pick you up. Then got banned for a day for playing Baby Shark accidentally. Yeah, they'll buy you for 50 million, then uh, turn your channel off. Idiots. If you have nothing to bring to the re uh, table in a relationship, don't bother. That's a good point. Harry, what do you have to bring to the table? What can you offer the ladies? A lot of things I can't say on YouTube. A oh. oh, criminal record? <laughs> <laughs> criminal record with the ladies, yeah. I don't know, it doesn't seem very nice what you did to Sophie, bro. But it is. He ain't living up to par, what's the point? Are you working in HR or relationships? <laughs> A yeah, HR stands for Harry's Relationships. <laughs> <laughs> What's the next date, Harry? Thursday. What are you gonna do? Uh, there's, a, there's like a big like light show for Christmas. Like a Christmas market as well. What is going on here? You bring every one of your dates out for like 
Are you, what are you, a Christmas killer or something? They always seem to disappear after you go to like a Christmas market or something. What's going on? Oh, they yeah. don't disappear. <laughs> but I have backups. <laughs> Backup. The gingerbread killer. Yeah, we'll take a look at the uh, Farming Simulator Academy Yield Guide. We'll take a look at that. We'll have Rick take a look and make a decision. All right. Not we're gonna herbicide or. I mean, we'll do. We'll have to do herbicide and fertilizer for contracts because that's what it requires. But for our own yield. Farming Sim 22 date. Oh, maybe. I think Harry just Big boss. Harry just doesn't want to be alone for Christmas, so he's just taking all these ladies out to all these markets and then leaves them. Wow. <laughs> Heartless, Harry. I thought you were. I thought you were a pod lad. Help a girl buy him buy him Christmas presents. I thought you were a good kid. What happened, man? You've changed. Times have changed. Yes. You sound like you work for Amazon now. You sit down with these girls and you're like, "Well, Sophie, profit margins need to be maintained." And unfortunately, we're, we're here at. That sounds a bit like you. Here at Harry Co. <laughs> we're letting You'll you go. You'll be going. Like you. You'll be going on too many toilet breaks. It's over. Hey, Rick. I noticed I can uh, spray f like the the wheat fields. I noticed they've turned a little dark color. I thought we couldn't spray again until uh, after sprouting. Oh, I it think those were. Can we spray after we did, first did the the planting because of the stage one fertilization? Because those planters uh, have that. I think those were little um, things we actually hit with uh, when we sowed the Nola. Okay. Like fertilized them twice, I'm pretty sure. But you can try it, see if it changes. I'll just I'll just do it next month. It's fine. No okay. more Gregs. Yeah, he's he's not taking his dates to Gregs anymore. Taking them to Costco. <laughs> I feel like we need What's to... What's that? What, what is it called again? Uh, what, Tesco. 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 Uh, I think I've been to a store called Costa? Costco? Costa? Costa. Well, there is a Costa. store in the United yeah. States called... Oh. Coffee shop? Yeah. yeah I've uh, yeah. been there once in Scotland. One. Wow, Rick, Mr. International. <laughs> do we have any herbicide on the farm? Or do we have to go to the store? Might have to go to the store. Well, at this point, we may as well just buy another flat bre uh, flatbread. Flatbread. bread. Flatbread <laughs> and bring it back, yeah. Sorry, I'm hungry. Pongo what, what what are kids your age like doing for dates? Like what's what's a new The Christmas stuff kinda seems nice and special and unique. It's only gonna happen one time a year. Like there's only really one month a year where all those Christmas markets and stuff are open. Take them out for food, in it? You go out for food? Oh Harry, you just go out because you're probably getting a discount. Yeah. Oh my god. Harry has a giant coupon book where it's like only two people only, but you get half off. <laughs> This this not this is a this is a devious plan. A devious lick. Devious. Well, I guess what you could do, Harry, is uh, I don't know. Do, do people even do? I, I feel like nobody goes to movies anymore because you can just watch oh, everything really? from home. It's not really a thing you do on your first day either. Movies? Mm. Yeah. Don't really talk to them. You're just watching the film. Well, that's true. I would like to go out to a dinner in a movie where you go out to a dinner first, but... Yeah, okay, maybe maybe, maybe a movie is not a good first date, but it's definitely part of the first dates. Yeah. Okay. A sort of stage, yeah. State, stage one? <laughs> one of growth. 
You're, you're talking about it like it's Kerbal Space Program. Uh, the, the, the stage one uh, propellant is a solid booster of going out for uh, lunch. Yes. I can't wait for uh, Kerbal Space Program 2. Oh, yeah. That'll be a fun one to play. Can't believe we don't have any herbicide. Yet. Herbicide. <laughs> uh, maybe we do. Maybe it's in the barn, but you're probably going to end up using a bunch of it. Are there not bag herbicides? Probably not because it's liquid, right? I don't think a bag would hold it. Oh, the oat is for horses. Yes. Walking around the park is alright, free and easy. Eh. I don't know, you gotta have something with a little excitement. Like, you wanna go somewhere between, between like, amusement park... Like, less than an amusement park, but more than a movie, I guess. Why not an amusement park? How's the farm in the U.S. with cows? On this farm, this our American farm, content farms, where we've been mostly doing crops, but we will be going to our uh, Swiss farm a little bit later. Yeah, we'll be doing member events uh, this uh, weekend, ha too. Harry hasn't been there yet, I think. If you guys want to... I have not. I've seen it, though. If you guys want to join this weekend, we'll be doing member stuff on probably Saturday again. We'll give time. Poglad's very busy now with all of his dates. Exactly. He doesn't have as much time for setups anymore. He's changed. Busy man. Did the frost on the ground never go away? Chat tells me that this is a glitch and it'll go away after spring comes again. Yeah, it's not even there on my screen. Yeah, not for me either. Harry is a weird name, uh, I guess. Hey, step in, wolf. He said you were Definitely. annoying earlier, but it's fine. <laughs> Can't say I've heard that one before. I'm the boss, so I get to decide. I don't think you're annoying. All right, yeah, we need to save the bill still January. Okay. That's all the bales we got from that wheat harvest, huh? That wasn't even that big of a wheat harvest. It was mostly just for the chickens. Yeah. But that's cute. Pretty cute. Alright, Rick, I went and bought herbicide. Right? Yeah, my bank account <coughs> isn't looking too healthy. IRL? Uh-huh. You want money? Fuel, fuel prices is redonkulous. How much do you need? I'll, I will fund this date, but I need to have updates. That's the deal. To be fun. That's the deal, Harry. That can be the deal. If I'm gonna be a shareholder at <laughs> at <laughs> Harry Co, a division of Tesco, I'm gonna I'm gonna need uh, access to information, like, like how it herbicide. went. Eh. Need herbicide still. Well, I got I got it. It's at the store now. You might oh. need some though for your uh, <laughs> one I of the jobs. Just finished it. Oh, you did. Okay. Both the rest of my uh, fertilizer. Um. Yeah. Okay. So then you can just drop off the rest of the herbicide at the barn, I suppose. Raptor, are you single? I I am. I am. What? what? <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Now hiring seasonal positions, I guess, like Harry, huh? <laughs> oh, is that what it is, Harry? Is it a seasonal position? <laughs> Christmas season only. Oh. Then may maybe a little into January just to get rid of the extra stock that you might have yeah. on the show floor. <laughs> yeah, I'm married second, to the algorithm. Second of January yeah. and I'm, I'm done. <laughs> what the hell? Where is the... Uh... I don't see anything on herbicide. Is there is there a way to learn more? Oh, improving yield. Uh, there are three methods to remove weeds. Spraying herbicide using a weeder or using a hoe. Weeders only remove the smallest weeds, so you need to be quick. With a hoe, you need to be able to remove small and large weeds with the sprayer. Even the largest weeds can be removed, but there might still be some left standing when you only start spraying right when the weeds have fully grown. It doesn't say anything, though, on that hurting the yield. Spread lime every three harvests using a mulcher plus five. Oh, that's nice. Rick, if you if you go to the Almanac tab, the Help tab, and go to Improving Yield, it lists it all right there. Oh, really? Spread fertilizer twice is plus 23. 
Uh, lime is plus 15. Mulcher is plus 5. Um, <laughs> uh, use a plow after root crops such as corn, potatoes, sugar beets. Oh, I think you read that before. I think you told me about that before. Uh, yeah. Uh, the yield is the yield comment is on their website. It should be in there, but yeah, see that, see that's the thing I was saying about the game too. Is that like a lot of you guys are saying, well, information's out there, but it's like, dude, if you're sitting on your Xbox in your living room, like I don't know, you shouldn't have to pull up like a laptop, a tablet, and a phone just to try to get all the information on. Just like, just give us the numbers. Just tell us what to do. You know, just tell players what how to get the maximum yield. Tell us every bonus and every every bonus and every negative. You know. Oh. Yeah. Damn. Oh, lad, are you at 52? Yeah, I thought I'd just do it while I was there. Uh, let's see. Oh, the other one is uh, fertilizing on 57. Yeah, I'll head that. I'll head that now. Well, okay. I have that... nothing. I have nothing left in the tank. Oh, okay. Well, that's perfect. Swing by the fertilizer thing. Yeah. Ah. <sighs> Harry's going on like multiple dates too. Is there any like is there any rules to that? It's like Buy more fertilizer. Harry's going on multiple dates at a time, Rick. It it's it's really like he's trying to f fill a position at a company and he's trying to get the best candidate, but is I don't think there's anything wrong with that, is there? Like going out on multiple <laughs> dates? Well, as long as you're not like in a proper relationship, I suppose. Mm. Harry, are you married to the streets or to the game at all? Or he might be a swinger. No. That was the 60s. That was Harry's grandparents. Oh. Oh. I see. Women hate it. They only they want only one. Uh, maybe it's a competition thing. I don't know. Doesn't love the tool lad. What? Who doesn't love a tool, a tool lad? Oh, so you're saying it's a, a a seller's market for you? Exactly. In other words, prices are high <laughs> down at the old uh, grain mill. <laughs> and the beef crystal mill. And and the and, great demand. Wow. <laughs> there's a there's a great demand for a six foot five plus lads. Yes. What's six? What what is six foot five? Even in centimeters. Uh, he's like 200. Like 200. Yeah, here's like 205. Yeah. That, oh, wow. <laughs> I didn't know you were that tall. <laughs> Extra cost how, on the shipping. How tall is Rick? Uh, 175. Oh, God. I think I can see the weeds. Oh yeah, good. Just missed a little on the edge, but that's all right. Yeah, maybe because Harry's tall, it's a it's a buyer's a seller's market for him. I don't know. I mean, I'm just saying though, Harry should probably get the kitchen remodeled, if you know what I mean, Harry. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what that means. I was just asking if you know what it mean. <laughs> I don't know either. I can only think what it means. You're fine. You're doing everything that's expected of you at 17. 
Staying out of trouble, working a job, helping out the family. No, you're fine. Exactly. You're not out committing, like, arson or dumpster what? fires, so you're fine. Uh, does Rick's dad ever hop on farming sim and just farm sugar beets? I don't, I don't know. Does your dad want to join uh, multiplayer, no, no, no. Rick? <laughs> he barely even touches the computer. When Harry uh, abandons the community for uh, uh, Mistress 5 or whatever, we'll, we'll need somebody else. Oh, this is what's happening, folks. We're witnessing the beginning of the end of Harry's time on the channel. Oh, this is it. It's the Pinto Syndrome. Well, Pinto Syndrome didn't fully kick in until about 22. Pinto's 24 now, so... Eh, Harry's got about... I'm going to just say four years. Somewhere between 20... 21, 22. Oh, but the UK has a, a smaller drinking age, so can't you already go out for a pint with the lads? Next year I can. Oh, oh my six, god. In six months' time. We have six months left, chat. We'll have to do a montage of all the moments. <laughs> uh, plenty of moments. You're still married to farming, Sim, though. I am. I will always be. That's, that was your first your first love. Well, that and those damn uh, chocolates that you have in your drawer. Or whatever they are. What's wrong with this sewing machines? They're, like, impossible to get into the shed. Be good. Oh, yeah, Rick, I realized the hitbox on the front of those things is really screwed up. Yeah. Like, I was try trying to drive around a telephone pole with one of those, and it's, like, two times wider than the front of the machine. So, like, you can pass a tractor through no problem, but the machine, which is the width of a tractor, is way too... way too wide. Yeah, it's weird. Hitbox is probably why it's making, uh, why it's being so annoying in the shed too. Let's see. I oh, will just get the edge now. What's up, Slav? How you doing, dude? Welcome to the streams. Good to see you all, chat. Thanks for dropping off your likes at the door and. Thanks for all the super chats this week, and thanks for all the uh, new members and stuff. Appreciate all the support. I hope you've been enjoying all the fun and new adventures we've been on this week. <sighs> Harry, why are we tired out? Stuff. Uh oh. There's a lot of uh, cloak and dagger going on with you lately, Harry. What's going? Yes. On? What's going on, lad? <laughs> a lot of cloak, a lot of dagger, a lot of dates. He's getting tight lips, so some things must either be going very well or very bad. One or the other. Harry's smart, though. He knows not to say anything. Again. At least to the ladies. At the end of your first date, you gotta be like, uh, Thanks for coming out. I've reviewed your qualifications. Give you a call. <laughs> your starting wage will be, uh... I don't know, even... Five pounds in a, an hour? Uh, one date per week. One date per week. Yo, Gaming Ham, thanks for the 99. Appreciate that. 99 cents. What's wrong with Alex? Uh, nothing. He'll probably be around <laughs> Scuba diving. I mean, he played Farming Sim last time. Like, the last time me and Rick played, he was here. But, uh, he only came at the end. I don't know, Alex is in, uh, all these guys in their 20s are in this... From, like, 17 to 22, there's this weird period of, like, busy or not busy or... I don't know. He's French, poor Alex, yeah. Alex is cool. I could Alex I could hang out with. I think I would really get Alex 
we would probably get in a very like tense verbal argument and I would probably want him dead but then I could I don't know I feel like he's the type of person I would argue with but I also like respect and think he's got some pretty valid points on a lot of stuff don't tell him I said that but hey Rick I see 45 46 need plowing does Five that foot six yeah does that count for the cultivator Oh, that's the um, grapes. Uh, I don't think, can we do that? I don't think. Wait, oh, we have a disc. Oh, for the six. Need plowing. Yeah, we have that disc arrow. That uh, that counts. Okay. Need to do that. Um, like at the end of the year, I think again. Well, it says it needs it now. Can't we just do it now? Oh, actually, this. Hold on. What? When do we need to harvest those things again? Uh, October. A uh, Raspido says, um, "Guide to a uh, guide to snow bug fix. Go to your save game. Uh, open the environment XML. Look for snow physical height. Oh well, I don't know if this is snow though. This the map thinks it's all like frosty, like all the trees and stuff are frosty. So does that does that have anything to do with the snow? Because this isn't necessarily snow. It is, but it's not really." Uh, let me know. I'll be kind of curious to know if I can fix that, because this is kind of annoying. This is your first time in the live stream? Welcome aboard, Gift Gamer. Thanks very much for tuning in. Yeah, it does? Okay. Well, maybe I'll fix that after this. Um... Actually, Rasp uh, Rasp Raspacito, could you uh, DM me on the Discord? And just copy paste that information. Links in the description if you haven't joined. Just set, send me that, and I'll uh, I'll fix it after this this stream for this map because the the Swiss map's okay. Okay, actually, yeah. When when are we going to? Uh, I guess we can go into like the Swiss map in an hour. What else is there to do here? Contracts. Um, next month, Olas. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Sorry, and I after that, that we this can do the, the cultivating. Uh, oh, we harvest. Plowing. Wait, don't you have to harvest mulch and then cultivate? Or no? Uh, no, the mulching is just whenever the grass grows high. Oh, okay. Okay, let me make sure that is their harvest date. Yeah. Yeah. That's funny that olives are only available like one month a year. Yeah, just odd. Uh, what happened to the game with the land aircraft carrier with treads? Uh, that is a game called Homeworld. Deserts of Karak. That game's on the channel. Also, a lot of people have been asking me to play, like, uh, Donna Man and stuff again, but I already did a playthrough. This is why I'm so absolutely furious with YouTube and their algorithm and stuff, is that you guys have been asking me to do stuff that I've already done on, on the channel, and I know you guys haven't been seeing it because you wouldn't be asking for it. Like, it's, it's so dumb. Like... Like, later today, like, in my next stream, someone will be like, Yo, Raptor, you should play Farming Sim again with Harry and Rick. And it's like, oh my god. <laughs> like, we'll be playing Icarus, and they'll, they'll, it's like, I don't understand why YouTube has to hold channels hostage and stuff. It's like, they don't want you guys to have free thought. That's why they removed the dislike button and stuff. Like, they don't... I, I, it's so hard for me not to mention it, but it's like, I don't understand why it's such a bad thing for you guys to actually subscribe to stuff you like and then to actually watch it. They're so afraid of you guys having... Like independent thought and likes, it's ridiculous. They want you. Nice. They just want you guys constantly watching shorts. Just get those get those ad numbers up for Susan. She's really trying hard to keep yep. that job. Get her ass out of there. But honestly, if they get rid of her, someone worse is going to come in. All right. I think once Harry's back, we can sleep. Yeah, I've done. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> As a uh, <laughs> a snow runner DLC comes out. Dude. Tomorrow. Okay. See. All right. Now hold on. Now Harry. <laughs> now. Now hold on. Hear me out. I'm actually interested because it's not freaking snow again. I'm actually interested. Oh. I'm I'm interested but because it, it looks like fall time again. Uh, it's Maine, where, where Bradford's from. And I'm down with that because like the the last couple of DLCs have been like you know build a giant factory in this in Siberia build a uh, it's like I want more I want more American maps, but I also build want a giant more factory in Maine. Although the game is called uh, Snow Runner. I, it is refreshing to actually be able to switch between not snow maps and like snow maps, you know. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. 
Well, independent thought is dangerous for pro profits, yes. I wonder what new trucks they're coming with. Uh, There's yeah. only two new vehicles. Oh, really? I thought I read four. Uh, it might be. Might, might be How many? Four. No, two not sounds not. two sounds right. Four sounds like a lot, just for two new maps. Minecraft, please. I actually saw somebody playing the cave update. That seems cool. Uh, I don't know. I want I want the channel to eventually be bigger, though, so that way, no matter what I play, a lot of people will tune in. But um, you got to kind of be more. YouTube requires this always this like nuclear energy all the time. Like you got to have the some of these wowas need to hit the AZ five because it's like, dude, you guys are gonna melt down in your mid thirties. No, Minecraft's cool. Uh, I want to play a vintage story again. Minecraft, you mean? Is this Minecraft? <laughs> Who the hell's calling me? Oh, the package is out for delivery. Ooh. All right, let's see. Fortnite win, probably not Fortnite, but I'll, I'll just I'll just have to do what the algorithm wants. The channel is just going to become Roblox Shorts. That's it, guys. YouTuber, when is the Fortnite stream? A what package? Uh, I forgot. <laughs> uh, developer. Oh, uh, a developer is sending me. Uh, Somebody offered me to play their darts game on the Oculus Quest 2 or whatever it's called. Is that it? Oculus Quest 2? Uh Anyway, Quest 2 or the Rift? I'm getting uh, I'm getting into VR basically. Ah. A developer nice. was like, "Hey, we're going to send you uh, a VR headset to play our new game." And I'm like, "Okay, there's there's like a couple of VR games that I'd be interested in trying once, but I don't know if I'd ever want to do anything more than a video on them. Live stream would be hard because I wouldn't be able to read." I think there are ways to reach us, actually. Probably, but... I don't know if I want chat in my face all the time. Uh, I, I love VR, though. Uh, I think there are ways to, like, if you, like, turn your hands towards you, you can reach chat. I've seen that happen on, like, streamers. Did you forget to turn the harvester on there, bud? Huh? It looks like, you did... it looks like you're not doing that whole row. Got 11%. It doesn't show harvested though. Suck. Really? Well, at least not, on the, not on the map. I can't tell because it's all frosted, so you, you better do the harvest because I can't even tell. I'll go over it again and have a look. Bailey C, how's it going? Good to see you back in the chat. Uh, you probably need to use the tipper trailer on the uh, on this green one. Yeah, no, it's harvested. Wait, does that say damage? Oh yeah, damage. Yeah. Do you really do you really think that's damage? You know, like wear and tear. <laughs> yeah. It's like saying, "Oh, my car's totaled. It needs a new oil filter. It's totaled. <laughs> it's unsalvageable." Like what? No, dude. Just, just put in a new filter. No, dude. It's totaled. Gone. Done. I was looking into Oculus, but when I found out Facebook owned it, oh yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. I, I forgot I, I, about I, all that. At some point, I want to get into the five two, but it's uh, it's a lot of money. A rat will pay for it. <laughs> oh, well, who would say no to that? Well, hi Bailey, thanks thanks for dropping in the channel. Uh, Farming Sim twenty two Pro Farmer again with the two. You rock looking for work mainly trucking. Oh, well, good luck to you in your uh, search for trucking jobs. I hope I hope that works out. Speaking of trucking, Harry, we should probably do some ATS Euro Truck soon for members. Yes. What the hell am I stuck on? And also, I I'm kind of I'm kind of thinking I don't know tomorrow. I don't want to do Snowrunner tomorrow. What am I stuck on? Are you hauling That's the coming planter? out tomorrow already? No. Oh. Yeah, according to Harry, yeah. Ah. Huh. Yeah, this is one day left. Steppenwolf, please be nice to Harry. I if you don't like him, that's fine. But like, just be just be respectful to everybody in the chat, please. Okay. Harry's a good friend and uh, good lad. I want him in the yeah. I want him here. He's a good guy. Damn, those hit those hitboxes are really big. 
crazy. <laughs> hey, put your gun away. <laughs> uh, hey, Rick, where do you want me for offload? Uh, I think where that class is parked. Yeah, probably. All right, I'll, I'll circle around. I'll tell you what, though, the the most cringe thing I think I've ever seen, though, is Zuckerberg's, like, metaverse thing that he keeps trying to sell. Like, dude, yeah. stop it, dude. Not your personal information, it's metadata. <laughs> I need to know everything. Tell me. Dude even looks like an AI. Yeah, he looks like frickin' Lieutenant Commander Data. Yeah. Like, he looks like an android. I think Data looked more human than him. Oh, damn. <laughs> Hello, fellow humanoids. It is the traditional winter giving season. Give me your information. This time I'm not asking. <laughs> I'm telling you. Harry has a nice voice. Yeah, if Harry doesn't start behaving, I will go back to some of the old farm sim videos and we'll watch them live, actually. <laughs> we could do that, uh, huh, Harry? Yes. That'd be kind of fun, wouldn't it, Harry? Oh, also... Lad's very quiet now. Think he fled. I do miss, uh being Harry's age though we're like a friend linking up with a friend just to do something for a few hours was like a big a big highlight you know like when your friend was free and you were free you know you get a call from your friends like what are you doing dude nothing dude what are you doing nothing dude oh dude we should hang out and it's just like four hours of Mario Kart nothing gets done oh I miss those days oh you're off muted now Harry welcome back yes uh Raptor too many girls to keep up with law are you talking about me yeah. Well, I got Wendy, I love, Wendy's and I love Lady the gray Liberty. Hairs. They do, yeah. I mean, I know you I know, do you want me to be mad at that cuz that really doesn't I get <laughs> more know. I'm I get more compliments on that than anything else, Harry. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with a little gray, bro. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> hey, the last couple of years have been stressful though. So please give me a break. <laughs> give you a break. Why are you uh, teeing? Harry, I, you're going to go bald in your family. You keep laughing at me, but it's like... You're going to go bald, Harry. Uh, what else can we do? More fertilization, right? Oh. They're in herbicide at the moment. Yeah, 47, okay. So you're going to do f fertilization. Wait, you're doing herbicide? Yeah. I'd rather have gray hair than no hair. See, look, the ladies love it. It just means that I'm uh, experienced, Harry. Assume that gender. With, grow with experience. Large, throw a large beard and uh, shave your head. Might look like... Um, a lot of other generic world YouTubers. As uh, some YouTubers call it. I don't know. I hope the chickens are well fed, right? I think we gave them maximum food last month. Let me check. Yeah. It's, I think. I'm gonna, I'll do, I'll do chickens this morning. All right. 3,600 liters, so they're definitely gonna need more food. Wish you could open the trailer like without going inside the truck. Oh yeah, we need to sell um, December. Is it right? We need to sell the canola oil. Uh, yeah. And aren't eggs high in? Oh wait, weren't eggs really high in October? Oh, possibly. Let me check eggs. Uh, if that's the case, we should have waited last month. Yeah, that's okay. We probably needed the money for something. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it's... probably yeah. Oh, it's the highest in November. All right, let's wait this month. I'll put it in the trailer. Oh, we'll, yeah. We'll hold on to it till next month, and then... All right. 
Uh, the sell price of what was the other thing we wanted? Uh, uh bills in January. Yeah, that's uh, straw, right? Yeah, straw. Yeah, that's gonna be January. Yep. It looks like all bales are high in January. Oh. Straw does plummet in February, though. Yeah. Which is weird. Um, what else are we producing? Olives we're going to bring over to the market. Canola we're going to bring over to the market. Oh, uh, wheat. I wanted to see what we had in storage. Is there a way to see storage for wheat? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's on the right side. Okay. So we have 27,720. I don't know if that's going to be enough to feed the chickens. Yeah, well, we'll bag it if we need to. It'll be enough, right? I mean, it should be, yeah. Because they're eating two th somewhere around 2,000 per month. Yeah. And we just need to make it to the June harvest. And we have two pens. Yep. So, so less than 4K per month times... Uh, four four months, five months, whatever. There we go. You just downloaded a. Uh, oh, there's a mod for the auto pallet loader. Nice. I feel like the developers really should just take a lot of the mods and make it a base feature because I think that's just going to increase sales. If the developers yeah. put a lot of these mods in and like remove one step, it just it adds a feature to the game. It's like, dude, the community's doing the work for you to show you what's. I mean, if you go to the mod page and find out that there's a mod that's like been downloaded 33 trillion times, just put it in the game. <laughs> Like, if there's a mod for, uh, I don't know, let's say a mod that, well, like the Seasons mod. That's why this game's gotten, this game must have, like, very positive reviews so far. It's not perfect yet, there's definitely some problems. But it's nothing that's, like, frustrating or, like, anno like annoying. I mean, like, I think the server browser's cutting better. Yeah, but that was kind of a launch day thing, right? Or no? Uh, that had a decent bit of trouble with it later, too. But they might have fixed stuff server side now. Minecraft's been adding popular mods to the base game for years. Yeah. And that's the thing too, is that even like even with a massive corporation like Mike Microsoft, they still can only add so so much as a company. The mod makers are the ones making all the games and the you know, like bed wars and that kind of thing. Yep. What? What? You said yep really loud. Oh. Did you agree with me really loudly? I sure did. Yep. Okay. All capitals, yep. Did your mom come in? You going on the date with that 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 last tomorrow? Yes. Yes. Yes, sir. You know what I uh stumbled upon on a live stream the other day, Harry? Uh, farming Okay, so there's an actual f version of Farming Sim that's like for the bail com competition. It looks like a mobile phone game. But they have like a, a competition, like a competitive version of Farming Sim. Have you seen this? Yeah. Dude, yeah, it's on their Discord. Dude, there's people who are it's driving at like sport. top speed, like between buildings and stuff, like trying yeah. to get maximum. I'm, and I'm thinking to myself, bro, F that. Like, no way. Yeah, it's the esports, isn't it? It's insane. Like, somebody was driving like a, a tipper trailer at top speed. Yeah, because um, they, they, um, they do like challenges. Yeah. Within each other, like bailing stuff like they have to harvest a wheat field and bail it and but they were doing they were literally doing it like a, a like an esport like they had a pitcher and pitcher between the two competitors yeah. and you had people narrating it you know i was like yeah, they, they get live streams bob nelson stuff. coming in with the john deere right now he's gonna be able to offload at 1.2 <laughs> liters per second this is gonna give him advantage as you can see here he's reversing into the southwest corner of the uh of the uh grain pit <laughs> so that way he has an advantage when he pulls a 180 now the uh, radius turn it's like my god dude this is like a farming game dude but I guess you can make anything like that. Wait a minute, Harry. What if we did your dates like that? Oh. Like I'll have an on-screen thing. 
Yeah, we'll have a camera and I'll circle things like on the smart board, you know? And it'll pop certain things up on the screen. Now you can see right here where Harry's holding his fork. He's actually pointing with the fork here, and this is a sign of aggression, but also a lack of confidence. Harry's starting to slouch in his chair now, which means he's getting bored. But still, when he slouched in his chair, he's still a towering menace within the McDonald's. <laughs> Looks like Harry's gone with the McChicken. A substandard interesting choice. menu item. Yeah, very interesting choice when he could have had the southern style chicken without the pickles. But as you can see here, Harry ordered the uh, McChicken as it already comes without the pickles. Interesting. <laughs> me, and me and Rick are going to have to do a commentary <laughs> on this. Now, we don't know exactly oh, what yeah. this means, but... Oh, and she's crossing her arms looking the other way. It looks like it's game over for Poglad. No longer making eye contact, both looking at the floor. <laughs> This is going to be an awkward, awkward walk home. <laughs> this cool. awkward walk home brought to you by Tesco. <laughs> and how? And it does a he... it does a transition graphic, uh, Harry, where like a bag blows in front of the screen, a Tesco <laughs> plastic bag blows in front of the screen. Or just do a nature documentary style. And Ooh. now we see the male making a move. Dennis says, on the uh, female. Ubisoft officially announced season four of Anno 1800 just a few minutes ago in their holiday hmm. stream. Also, Anno 1404 is a giveaway. It can be downloaded for free. Oh, that's a great game, Anno 1404. I kind of haven't really been into Anno too much because the last DLCs have kind of just been. That game is so freaking beefy that it's just like. It's become like SnowRunner. There's just too much <laughs> to do and it's very intimidating, honestly. Uh, because I wish that game was kind of more now of a city builder rather than like painstakingly trying to balance a budget all the time. We'll probably go play Anno. Give me more information on a Anno, Dennis. Did they say anything about when the first stuff for season four is? Yeah, this walk home sponsored by Uber. <laughs> Why walk when you can <laughs> ride? Call Uber today. Yeah. Oh, what about? It's kind of like Civ Six, I guess. Uh, in Civ Six, like there's mm, a lot to do, but it's like so long. Oh yeah, yeah, but I, I would say Civ is almost more competitive than Anno because, like, Anno yeah, is true. um. Well, Anno a lot. If you played like the base version of Anno, uh, usually there's the pirates and stuff too, and for the most part, people won't attack each other. They'll just they'll be worried with the AI. I really enjoyed Anno. What was it? Twenty seventy six. 2070? I don't know. I don't remember what year it was, but it was on Twitch. No dates mentioned. Okay. Thank you. What did they did they make any announcements about what season four will have? Like, what's it going to be themed about? I'd love to go back and play Anno 1800 on the channel, but I've just live streaming is just so much nicer because I don't know. I don't have to do any editing, and I I actually get to chat with people. It's very lonely to record videos. I don't know. Even if it's, it's very, very, very stressful, Harry, to record videos, like in a group. Such like, a hard life. Well, do you remember when we were doing like, I mean, what would you rather do, Harry? Would you rather go back and do the Dino Diner series again with those? Oh, like, 100 percent. No way. Those tight yeah. turnaround times and all that f hyper focus. I I'd rather yeah. just chill. Ah. Uh, love that. Don't never see it built, but you know. All right. I'm gonna do money <laughs> cheat today and place that down. I was actually, uh, I think last night I was thinking about, like, I was scheduling the stream for Farming Sim, and I was like, it'd be nice to actually do the Dino Diner again. But, honestly, if we can't customize the building, because the fast food restaurant in this game kind of looks bland, like, what's it called? Let, let, let me go take a look at the building. Chat, thank you very much for 300 likes. Thank you to everybody smashing the like button. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you're all enjoying your Monday. Thank you very much for being here. All right, the fast food place is called Main Street Diner. What is that called? Main. What the, the hell? The Rat that? Pack Diner. Oh, Dino oh, it's diner. called Mama Joe's. Mama, Mama Joe's Diner. Herbicide. That's like abandoned. It looks like a building from my summer car. Oh yeah, it probably is. Oh, that's also a game I'm looking forward to. My winter car. Mm-hmm.
Down on Asheville, proceeding towards oil production. Over. Gosh darn right. it. Um, Run out of herbicide on my last field. Which one do I need to do? Uh, you can actually see the uh, olives on the branches. Yeah. I just had to zoom in a bit. What's this harvest? That's an olive harvester. So we're hauling. Yeah, I was afraid of that. We're harvesting olives this month, and then. I think this will be our last crop to harvest for the year. Yeah. Uh, can someone tell me how to water cows in the feeder robot pens? Aren't, isn't what, that automatic? I, uh, I, I think barns are automatic yeah. for water. It could be automatic. Yeah. As in, like, you don't have to give them water at all. Like, it's not even a thing you have to worry about. I wish it kind of was, to be fair. Yeah, me too, because it's kind of confusing. Like, the only thing you need is the pastures. Alright, uh, does someone want to take over the olive harvest? I need to go for dinner. Uh, yep, I'll do it when I get back with the olives. Alright. Or lad. I need to fill up with oh, the side um, again. Alright, I'll take care of it. I'll be gone for like half an hour, so I'll look out. Take your time, Rick. We'll see when you get back. Alright. Yes, in a bit. Alright. I'll pick on the lad in the meantime. What's the plan for you, lad? I was I was thinking about like where you are now in life. What's the plan? What's the plan? You're 17, living in the UK. We we got Harry, Harry lore going on. You yes. you're working at the uh, what would you call it? the groundskeeper? Uh, what? it's quite, it, it's specified as greenkeeper. Greenkeeper, the old golf course. Yes. The queen will be passing soon. Yes. I will become king. What? What's, what will the future hold for a young pog lad? Uh, uh, when is the dairy farming? I think we're going to do dairy farming in like 30 minutes, as soon as we're done with this olive harvest. Yeah, what, I don't actually know. There's a lot of things I would like to do. See, here's the problem with asking Harry that question. is like, yeah, some of you guys in the chat are saying like five-year plan. Which is true, but like at 17, I don't even think I knew what I was going to do at 19. I didn't even think 19 really existed. Ni when you're 18, 19 is like three years away. It's amazing how slow time works, though, when you're like 16, 17, 18, and then how quickly it goes when you're like 26, 28, 29. Well, that's mostly because you're working, but... As, as, do you think time has sped up for you in your life, Harry? Oh, definitely. 100% in the last two years, time has... Since, since Rona, really. Oh. oh. Oh, you think time's sped up? Gone so fast. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not really sure. I would like to work abroad at some point. And what does that mean? I work on a farm or something, most likely. Or a different golf course, I'm not in sure. Inter international farm exchange? Yes. <laughs> and go and work at a nuclear power plant. Oh, that's what <laughs> your plan is. That's your dream plan. Yeah, they're in the middle of building one, sort of near me. Because there, there's like different levels. There's like your, your on a, there's like your dream where you, you wish like, oh, it'd be cool. If like I got selected for, like junior nuclear assistant or something. Like <laughs> there's just a knock at your door and a bunch of guys show up in suits. Uh, hi. And they're just like, lad, we want you on our. we we need a lad. You know, lad. <laughs> we need a tall lad to reach the controls. We goofed up when we made our power plant. We made it a little, the controls a little too tall. That one too, you know. Like, the questions are like, are you familiar with nuclear power? Can you tell if a button is blinking? <laughs> are you familiar with the sense. letters A and Z and the number yes. five? Five. Uh, yes. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Okay, you're in. Work for Raptor Incorporated in Minnesota. See, that's the thing. I would. It'd be kind of cool to have my friends working for me, but it would be... Uh, Oh, yeah. Reading a text message. I did, yeah. I actually got a notice about a something that I need to forward. Okay.
Yeah, I, uh, I asked a question on a bill, and I was like, hey, I, I can't pay this unless you guys give me the actual dollar amount. And they're like, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and they sent a bill, and then... I got a notice for my my life insurance and health insurance, uh, not health insurance, but some other insurance, and then they were well, like, "Health insurance would be pretty high." No, no, it was it was something else, but it, they sent a notice, and they were like, "This bill is due on this date." So I said, "Hey, I'm uh, ready to pay this, but like, it's going to be past the past due date if you guys don't tell me how much." And then they sent a message, and they were like, "Hey, yeah, we're going to go ahead and uh, call this good because <laughs> it was our <laughs> like our bad. Pay it next week, and then." Now it's next week, and it's like, yeah, you guys have to give me a dollar amount, though. Oh, okay. It's like, oh. okay. Well, now you have to pay me for literally doing your job. I'm charging you. The hell, I can't tell what the hell Fields Rick has done because of this damn graphical glitch. Damn it. All the olive trees to me look like there's snow on them, so I can't tell. Yeah, I can't tell either. No, they, all, they all look the same. They don't look harvested for me. Well, usually you should be able to see the olives on there. There we go. I wonder if I should just pay this bill for like the next 10 years. Just give them a bunch of money. It's so annoying. Dies next year. <laughs> Well, you know, one of the things is that, like, auto pay is very nice because you don't have to deal with the, um... Usually what I'll do is I'll get an email before a bill is due, and then I'll get the confirmation saying, Oh, hey, uh, the money's been taken out or something, and I'm like, good. I don't know. I mean, if you're going to take my money, you do, you do it then. <laughs> you do the work. No, it's just, it's, no, Chad, it was one of those things where they, uh, they sent me a letter, uh, the dollar amount was wrong, and so I said, hey, uh, this is not accurate, send me an accurate number. And they were like, oh yeah, our bad. But when they said our bad, it was like, they forgot to also say our bad, here's the actual amount, so it's like, well, I hate that so much. Because then you'll get the automated email saying, this bill is past due. But it's like, it's not because the lady said, <laughs> I'll mark this as, like, good in our system. Just, uh, whatever. I hate that because I feel like I did something wrong. I don't. Okay, anyway. It's a boomer moment here. I'm trying to be fiscally responsible, lad, okay? Yeah. <sighs> How come we have two sewers now? Uh, just because it went twice as fast and they were on sale. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, I wonder what is on sale. Oh, yeah, good question. The Mack truck? Nope. May as well be a golf cart. <laughs> uh, nothing else. Baler. Nope. Yeah, we have a round baler. Yeah. We bought a square baler on the other farm. Harry, as soon as I'm done with this uh, harvest, so I think we should jump over the... the we're going to go do the dairy farm. Yeah, I haven't been on that one before. Uh, yeah, uh, I know. Now, now I'm stressing out, Chad, because I, I hate these bill things where, like, you got to you gotta call somebody, and then they got to call... I always... That's what annoys me. wait on the phone. Well, it's what <laughs> here's what annoys me about my YouTube rep is that my rep is good, but he's mo he's mostly like a mailman, right? I tell him the problems that I'm having on YouTube, and then he basically writes up a report and then puts it in the mailbox of anybody who can help, right? So sometimes you'll have an analytics issue, sometimes you'll have a live issue, sometimes you'll have an issue with like I don't know, um, uploading a video, and that's all different departments. So it's like, and it's like. And then YouTube's like, how are we doing? It's like, horrible. Because you you, ha you gave this guy a job to basically talk to me and a bunch of other YouTubers about what we think about YouTube and how to improve it, except you never listen. You hired this guy to tell you what the problems are, but then you don't listen to him. So it's wasting our time and his time. I mean, you may as well start paying me YouTube. I, I, want, I, want, I want $100 million a year emotional damages fee. Trust and safety fee. 
Minimum. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you ran so much. <laughs> Yeah, well, my my middleman, my YouTube rep is fantastic, but I I kind of just stopped talking to him after a while because it's just like, and then YouTube like stopped sending me gifts and stuff like a little extra sugar for like giving them what they wanted. But it's like you don't listen to me anyway. YouTube is way superior to Twitch. I mean, in many ways, yes, but I think Twitch still has a way better chat system. I think Twitch has a way better. Um, like the global emote thing on Twitch is good. YouTube doesn't still doesn't even have gifting. You think that'd be the first thing to do? Yeah, Raptors is speaking the truth. I can't even help it. I can't. I I just can't even be positive anymore. I can't even. I can't even maintain the lie, man. I just can't do it anymore, Harry. I wish I were happy like you with your TikTok and your Zoom. Eight long years of this. <laughs> Really? Never changed. YouTube streaming is becoming more popular? Well, because YouTube's buying out all the competition. When you buy, like, six streamers who have, like, you know, 50,000 consecutive, and then you're like, oh, our views on YouTube are going up. Yeah, boy, I wonder why. I need, You know what I really need, Harry, is a secretary. That's all I That's need. Good. I need somebody to just, like, it's take... So bless. I just need I just need somebody to take care of it for me, you know what I mean? Basically it. like a hitman. That's all I need. Take out the target. Except for things that I don't uh don't want to do. Like things that are just painful to me, like making a doctor's appointment. I just hate I hate doing that. <laughs> I don't know why. Absolute hate. Yeah, I know. It's like hate, you go there, hate, it's like hate, forty hate, minutes, hate, my hate. my doctor, she's the nicest woman in the world. She's just like, uh, like the first time I met my, my doctor, she was basically, she shook my hand and was like, really, it was weird. Ooh, ooh, yeah. Well, no, she was ooh. very, like, usually doctors like don't even look at you. They throw their papers <laughs> down. It's just like, yeah, what's your name again? You know, or whatever. This woman like was like, wait a minute, ma'am. Are you, are you, she, she, she did a good job at faking like she cared. And so I was impressed with that. I was like, do I, do I tip you? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was, it was really cool, but it was like, but I don't like going there because I don't want to bother anybody. Just bring up a YouTube rant. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. It's just this, the the farming sim streams have just become old man yells at cloud now. That's all it is. Do you know that reference, oh, Harry? Yeah. <laughs> Tell me about the reference. Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> I don't. Because I know you just have you get even more mad. Just tab out. And type in "old man yells at cloud," and you'll just you'll know what I'm talking about. Uh, oh yeah, but no, you mean yeah. <laughs> no, my doc. My doctor's from Florida. She moved up here to marry her husband. She's she's super nice, but like, I don't I don't need to now go you there. Know for a lot of things about her. <laughs> well, we she actually like talks. I don't know. It's not all business. Like she she'll be like. Taking the blood pressure and asking questions while we also chat. Ooh. Harry, why does everything have to be... Why can't two people... <laughs> why can't two adults of the opposite sex have a conversation and it not be weird? Uh, why, do, why do you have to do that? It's not weird. She, <laughs> she was just nice. It's like... She was just a nice lady. Just, I don't know. Just admit, you know. Just admit. She... Look, man. Got she's... Bit, got a bit of a she, thing for the doctor. Bro, she, she's cute, bro. But, you know. Like, she there knows... You go. Bro, she knows my, like, blood type. That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, dude, she knows my like. Um, Ooh, she knows my uh, my. What, what is it called? Phle phlebotomy chart or whatever, bro. She knows. She, no, dude, she knows my family history, dude. And I'm pretty sure there's something in the hippopotamus oath that says she can't like date YouTubers. Okay, I'm pretty oh, sure yeah. that was like law one. Oh Christ! Now this is gonna be a thing. <laughs> Have to go to thing for the doctor. I haven't seen her in months. Maybe, maybe I should get <laughs> a little bit. Maybe up again. <laughs> <laughs> so I was thinking, maybe, maybe you should check my blood pressure again soon. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was thinking Getting about. A bit low. I, I was, uh, I was watching. A commercial reminded me of you the other day. <laughs> it told me to ask my doctor about 
uh, birth control? Do I need any of that? Uh, no. Uh, no. Well, I don't know. I mean, would it help with my time of the month? It's like, that's not how that works. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not getting weekly checkups, chat. Stop. I'm still rather young, so there's nothing. She never says anything young. either, other than. Off the gray hats. Well, it's like, I don't have to go in for. Like, as I'm not really on any medication, I don't really. I don't need to check with my doctor to, like, follow up on anything. It's basically just a yearly, like. He's pretty, he's pretty asking her to get medication so I can see him more often. <laughs> no. Yes. No. No, she's just, she, she's just, <laughs> chat, she's just a GP. She's a general practitioner, so it's just the basic stuff. It's not like... No big money. <laughs> we probably... Oh, wait, I shouldn't say that. I, I'm not going to say that. Never mind. <laughs> Send that to me on Snap, though. Send what to you on Snap? <laughs> what, what you no, because then you're going to... Now, then you're just going to say it. No, I won't say it. I won't say it. <laughs> Look, when I talk to you, Harry, we just ask you who you went out on a date with. Now, apparently, chat wants to see my chart. You want to see your blood type. Yeah, uh, which I don't even know what that is. I get my blood work done, and they just like... I don't even know why I get the blood work done. It's like nothing... No, there's no no news. Like, I, I just want to get checked for all the, the things, you know, like diabetes and all the whatever. I don't know. I, it just seems like the right thing to do, but it's just like... Can't find the blood sample in the merch store. Alright, chat, F off. Whoa, I'm not, I'm, the I'm, F bomb. I'm, I'm not putting the blood sample in the merch store, okay? Why? Make top dollar for that. Look, it, all I'm saying is this, right? It's nice... He's got a bit of a thing for the doctor, is all he's saying. It's nice to he's do... He's watching. It's nice... <laughs> I forgot her name. F. Uh... Uh, crap, I forgot her name. <laughs> this, is, this is looking great for you, I must say. She's not watching. She's at work. She's probably... Well, she has other... Pa she's seeing other people now, Harry. She has okay? no vacation turned yeah. on. <laughs> no, she doesn't. <laughs> she d she does know that I have a YouTube channel, though. We did talk about that. And then she took she's she took a lot of extra notes. She, like, opened up her... <laughs> <laughs> I know that. <laughs> she opened up her folder again and... Oh, oh, shit. Okay. She has a secret <laughs> microphone on. <laughs> She she wrote a couple extra notes in there. Interesting. She probably wrote like shorter life expectancy or something now. <laughs> she wrote up a report for the insurance company. Yep, he's a he's a goner. He's a goner. She she immediately had me on the table. Clear <laughs> It's like I'm still alive, Doctor. <laughs> Crap, I forgot her name. Oh well. Sophie? No. <laughs> Dude, I go there. I go there, uh, like once a year, dude. Oh my god, how? And she, haven't... but bro, she remembers everything. It's like she knows me, dude. <laughs> Probably your next door neighbor. Just never even realized. Well, what's weird, really weird though, is that I just found it. I just found it mind-boggling that I, I saw like one once every three hundred and sixty-five days. I jump in, and she like recalled stuff from a conversation, and I thought to myself, like, this person sees hundreds of people. It was just—it was okay. cool that she remembered something about me. Like I don't know, it was just—it was, it was just nice. To feeling well, I've had that happen before with barbers. Aww. Barbers will ask about my trips to Japan and stuff. Aww. God damn! I'm trying to have a conversation <laughs> with people and just <laughs> ball breaking over here, Harry. She likes me. She doesn't. She doesn't. No. She does. Let's be honest. She does. She has a. She has a bit of a thing. Have you have a bit of a thing there? I thought she was attra uh, an attractive oh, lady. <laughs> she, Harry, she, 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 she looked very nice, but she was married and also like we were in a professional setting. I can, you can, Harry, you can separate your like feelings for somebody for like the respect of their position. Come on, come on, Harry. It's not that big of a deal. <laughs> Someone's got to clip this. Oh my Christ. <laughs> Interrupt his beloved story about the doctor. She's nice. All right, then I'll go see the other guy. <laughs> I'll start seeing the guy doctor I had when I had the flu. 
Which, by the way, reminded me of how doctors really are, where it's like, Hey, I'm uh, here for the flu. I just want to make sure it's not something else. Oh, uh, yeah, it's the flu. Uh, nothing we can do. That's $1,000. Like, yeah, I figured, dude, thanks. Thanks for the, the bill. Thanks. But you give her a tip, I don't know. I, I seriously should just become a doctor where it's just, uh, yeah, nothing I can do. Oh, uh, oh you want to meet on the webcam? Oh, it's going to still be $1,000. Like, wow, $1,000 Zoom a call. But uh, you ch chat, you can, you can start paying for those doctor visits today by clicking the tap and join, becoming a member, only 99 cents. So, uh, 1,000 new members will uh, be able to pay off that uh, that next uh, phlebotomy visit. Mm -hmm. Jesus, just I've just loaded about 10 pallets on this trailer. <laughs> Oh, are you doing honey? Uh, no. Like the, um, the canola oil. They've just been kept, they just keep on spawning. At his age, he has a feeling about all girls. Yeah, Harry does. Me, it's just like, I, I can see... Oh, sing it. you're a single man, you know? Yeah, you know, fair enough. You're gonna find an but attractive woman. I can also see when there's, like, a guy who has attractive features that would be attractive to women, or possibly men. You, like, you can, you can tell there's a difference between, like, you know, Robin Williams and Jumanji, and, like, uh... Uh, what's his name? George Clooney. Like, th there's a difference in attraction to those guys. They're gonna, you, you know that. Like, that's something you can like ascertain, right? Yeah. Like, there's a difference between 19-year-old <laughs> Justin Bieber and like uh, when all the ladies went nuts for what's his name from uh, Willy Wonka. What the hell's his name? He also played Jack Sparrow. Oh, Johnny uh, Depp. Johnny Depp. Yeah. <laughs> there's there's a difference. Wow. Well, we'll, we'll go with the difference. We'll go with that. But anyway, in conclusion, Harry, I just want you to know that it's completely possible to... Have feelings for a doctor. Not feelings, bro! <laughs> okay, my feelings are like, if there was ever a questionnaire, and I'd be like, was your doctor nice? Yes. Was your doctor informative? Yes. Did your doctor answer all your questions? Yes. Do you, <laughs> do you feel comfortable with your doctor? Yes. <laughs> Is she a subscriber? Unsure. Like, I, you know, these are questions that we may not have answers to here. Oh, you definitely have answers for her. Hey, if she ever wants to start a YouTube channel, I'll help her out. But she's got to start giving discounts on those, uh, those band-aids. $53 to give you a shot and put a band-aid on? Come on, toots. I know she's not setting the prices, but on the other hand, come on. <laughs> Did you find your doctor attractive? Look, she was... It was her professionalism that was the first thing that really got my attention. It was it was nice to like have the cadence of somebody who really cared. Now she was young, so she probably still cared. But five years from now, it'll probably be like she'll be like a lunch lady or a bus driver. What's How your name young again? Is young? How she, she's either two years younger or older than me. Perfect. Oh Perfect. my God, Harry, stop! <laughs> this is a this is a professional woman who's married. Stop it. This uh, is she's probably not married. She is too. That's why she moved here. That's what she told me. Why would she lie? Why would my doctor lie? For you. She saw you on the channel. She, oh, please. She's watched everything. That was our first time meeting. It's funny funny seeing you here, doctor. <laughs> <laughs> At this hospital. We wouldn't have anything. In, okay, the only thing we would have in common is that we're both very busy and would never see each other. I'd be busy at home playing games, and she'd be busy actually doing something with her life. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Look, she's married, chat, but I'll, I'll let you know if anything develops between... She'll make exceptions for you, I'm sure. I'll probably go see her in January. Actually, I'll, all right, I'll go see her this month, and I'll like live right. stream the whole thing. <laughs> I'll do a live tweet. What a fun conversation! Yeah, I don't know. I guess, I guess I'll reveal the curtain a little bit, Chad, of things that I do in my life. I don't know. I I, w I wish I could say there were more instances where somebody like impressed me where I really remembered something like that. But what reminded me of it is the insurance company that just called. I mean, my life insurance company that called me, because that lady is usually really nice. But what's annoying is that it's it's one of these uh, middle people who are like, you know, someone will call you and be like, "Hey, uh, this thing needs to be done." And it's like, "Can you do it for me?" And then be like, yeah, I can do that for you. 
And then there's never any, like, f feedback or follow-up because they followed up with somebody, but then they never followed up with them. So I pay person A, I pay person A a lot of money to do stuff for me, and so they call person B, but person B, uh, didn't pick up, and so person A is like, ah, oh, what are you gonna do? Anyway, bills still do. <laughs> I don't know, just pay us. Right. We have 5,000 canola oil and 19,000 canola oil. I mean, olive oil. Wait, yeah. 5,000 5, olive and 19,000 canola. So, in conclusion, chat, uh, click or tap join and become a member today. Um, yeah, I'm gonna come over there. How much? Wait, are you only loading canola? No, I put more than that. I didn't realize just till now. Oh, you put. Oh, oh, no, you put olive oil on here too? Yeah, it's all on there. Well. Uh oh. I guess when you get to the destination, you'll just have to offload the olive oil because yeah. it'll be worth more. Canola, we have still 39,000 liters in there? That's gonna make. What is the rate of that? 100 to. No, 200 to 100. Oh my god. <laughs> that's still gonna make about 4. 20,000. Oh yeah, 20. Yeah. Oh my god. And that's 20 more pallets, Harry! Oh my god. How much, how much does canola oil go for? Uh, that's gonna be canola oil at. Holy crap, canola oil. Highest in December, by the way. Right now it's at 30. No, it's at 4,394 at the oh fast food. No, it's at 5,000! 5,000 at the farmer's market. And it's gonna, and the price will still increase two more times. Oh my, we're gonna have a lot of money. Yeah, I think our money problems are solved. <laughs> I'll have to buy a few more fields. I think we should buy a field with that too. This, uh, this stacking job is usually how mine and Harry's conversations go. <laughs> we're gonna be filthy rich, I hope so. Well, I mean, I gotta check and see what our loan is at. I think we took out another loan just to get some more stuff. I don't know. A loan is a constant thing in this game. Oh, we're maxed out again. Well, luckily at the dairy farm, we paid it back, but then we took it right out again. However, we only did it to buy land, and now we're making so much silage, it's ridiculous. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're going to do silage at the dairy farm. Probably right now, then, I guess, Harry. Yes, do Because we just finished the olive harvest, so the only yeah. thing to do now would be to just wait till next month to sell eggs, and then just wait until the canola and olive oil is ready to sell. Alone is a constant thing in life. Oh, yeah. I, I see what you mean. Alone. Yeah. Well, I do like my alone time. I need my space and my alone time. I'm like a cactus. <laughs> I'm like a cactus. No loan oh. farming? Ugh. I would not want to play that. Alright, lad, quit that game and I'm gonna do the new one. Uh... Oh, yeah, we were like negative money on that one. Because that game calculates the. Uh... Harry, in this game, when you take out. When you lease an item, is it is the lease due every hour if you're playing in real time? I'm. I thought it was done by daily. Me too, but I would assume that it's kind of cheating if you can put it in real time because then you could rent it for 2000 get a job done, and then like barely pay anything. Yeah, yeah. Uh, chat was true. saying it was the yeah. least, but all right, we're entering dairy, dairy territory. Yep, that's right. Cactus is a constant, though. At least I, at least we have some very wise women in the chat. We've, we've got, we got people from all different backgrounds and stuff. It's good. And I'll tell you what, though, I'll, the the people who've done the most work on the channel, other than me, is probably the ladies in terms of the clips. I can't believe how many clips. That chat has taken, and it's always like um, Tan, Ashley, Morgan, Indrid, and maybe. Well, then maybe there's like Baltimoreus and a few others, but the ladies, the ladies are thousands of uh, clips ahead. All right, Harry. So we're making uh, we're making dairy, Harry. Well, actually, silage. Are you there, lad? Oh, right, it might take a minute, you know. I don't have enough cows still. Oh, the sheep should be ready. Is this 8 a.m.?
Oh, uh, that's because ghouls, ghouls, girls rule the world. That's what Beyonce said. Oh, oh, well, I mean, Beyonce said it. All right, now we're at the dairy farm. So now we've got. Uh, we were doing silage. Me and Rick. Oh yeah, did we stack all the bales up at the? Oh yeah. Wait, what happened to the tractor? Oh my boy. That's 14 times 5. Wow. And a lot of silage. Yes, it is. A lot of money. Um, it's February, so we probably got to wait an entire year. Oh, yeah. Price Game plummeted. Coming up at all. I'll give it a bit. We'll sell in December. Oh, that's right. Yeah, the ladies are referred to as uh, brother sisters. Sister brothers. Everybody's a brother. Man. Hey, man, brother. Brother sisters. Gotta be another area to. Oh no, we we mowed everything. So me and Rick bought this. Oh, this one. That might be the other one to mow. Although I think we did it already. I gotta check these fields. You have a sister, don't you, Harry? Uh huh. You do. You have a sister, don't you? Yes, I have two. Wait, are you you the youngest? Yes. So you have two older sisters and then there's you. Yes. Are they out of the house? Yes. One is 25, one is 30. Hmm, I see. Yeah, and your game isn't coming up at all. I should have put it in multiplayer, right? Yeah. What if I invite you? You name of the game changed? No, it should be the same. Let me check. Oh yeah, yeah. It says wait, why did it change back to world's biggest harvest? Before it said just Raptors Farm. That's weird. Hold on. Yeah, I did change it, but I didn't mean to. That's weird. Okay, try that now, Harry. Chat's asking if you learned anything from your sisters, Harry. Uh, no. That means yes. They probably dressed him up when he was younger. Oh, Harry! Do you have any siblings? Uh, just chat. Actually, that's my children. Harry, do you have that's... any children? I do. I have my own chat. Oh, you do? Wait, are you streaming? No. <laughs> oh. What happened, man? When are you going to start streaming again? Can be. Wait, you what? I can be. I mean, you could, yeah. I mean, you kind of, like, sometimes you... I don't know, you kind of stopped, but... Yeah, I do it, like, once a month. Oh, really? Wait, have you streamed any of Farming Sim 22? Uh, I did once. But, yeah. Day one? Day one. Nice. Uh, thank you, Taylor, for being here, dude. Welcome to the big O stream. Alright, Harry, well, since you're here now, I'm just gonna be, uh, I'm gonna go mow a field, and we're gonna be making some more silage, because we're gonna make okay. all that money. this field ready? No. Hmm. I take you have a uh, wind roar. Yeah, we do. I don't see anything we have to do here. Rick, I'm just... We're back on the dairy farm now. Ah, right. Oh, the field up here is ready. 
Oh, that's because we usually don't mow that area. Okay. It's too steep. Huh. This way, for some reason, my screen is still on the American map. Yeah, that happened to me. <laughs> just, just, said it was, just said the game was paused. Yeah, I have to restart my game. We're we're all we're all done with mowing. Oh. Oh, chat wants Harry's uh, Harry's details for his channel. Yeah, go ahead if you want to share Harry. Now's a good time to advertise your channel, mate. We still need to wait before we sell the the silage, right? Yeah, we need to wait until uh, January of next year. Oh man. So I don't know what oh, we're gonna yeah. do in the meantime. Yeah. I mean, I guess what we could or do is. At some point. Well, yeah, we're gonna have to wait a couple months though, because everything's mowed now. Yeah. Uh, we could do. Some it's February, but there could be some jobs to do, but they're probably not great. Yep, not really. We could try to get uh, pallets dropped off from the... Uh... Oh, no, the sheep are all loaded up. Yeah, I don't know what else we could do. Yo, Pro Farmer with the dollar. Thank you very much for the support, dude. Appreciate you smacking that uh, dono button. And thank you, chat, for the 300 likes. It's nice to know you guys still want to see some farming sim. Thanks for the support. My dinner is ready. I shall be back shortly. Oh, it's funny. You guys are, like, in shifts. Yeah, I just wanted to say that. Uh, price fluctuation chart isn't that accurate at all. Yeah, it's kind of just a guesstimate, really. I mean, it's kind of more of a simulator than it is like a accurate uh, rendition of IRL. It's close, but yeah. I mean, there's no, there's actually no like values here, so I don't know if this is ten million dollars. I mean, you can kind of compare. <laughs> Alright, I'm in. And immediately the rock music starts playing. <laughs> so, uh, Rick, everything's been mowed. We have silage already waiting down at the, uh, we have silage waiting at the, uh, barn. Or, uh, at the animal dealer. I yep. think we just have to wait a month, but now Harry went to eat. Now I gotta kick him out. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else for us to do at the moment, so I think we're ready to go. Yeah. YouTube decided I don't need notifications anymore. Yep. That's why I do that. That's why uh, typically not a lot of people... Uh, a, lot, a lot of the comments will be, when are you going to play X, no X game? And I've already played it, and then they... Nobody got a notification. It's a mafia. YouTube will control what you watch. It's all part of the all part of the game. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to kick Harry out, and then I think we gotta skip. I'll make him a farm manager. Then I'll kick him out. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> we need to skip to the next month, so let's do that. I'll make him a farm manager. Then I'll kick him. Yes. He's not even in a farm. Did you already kick him? Yeah, I did. Oh, okay. So if we skip this month, it'll be March, so that means we'll do spring jobs. And maybe the grass will be regrown? Hopefully. Maybe. Uh, that means we'll have to get that uh, trailer from the uh, animal dealer again. What's up, Fiber? Good to see you. Oh, you mean the auto trailer? The auto stacker? Yeah. yeah you can swing down there and pick it up. Yeah, you, um, yeah if we don't need to mow yet, we I can just take the glass.
How's the grass looking? Ready to harvest. Excellent. Well, all right. We begin um, again. Actually, I should probably borrow some money and hire another tractor again. Else, it's yeah, gonna take a long time. Or yeah. you won't be able to with the negative eight thousand. Can you do a job on the side? Uh, not really any good jobs, but we do still. We did pay the loan back a decent. We can borrow like um, eighty-five k. What? To bar to to borrow a track? Oh god. Yeah. Uh, you do whatever you got to do. I'm gonna go mow lawns. I'm gonna go start in the right field. All right. For plowing snow, the snowcat comes in handy. Yeah, that's a cool uh, piece of the update is, or the the new stuff in the game is uh, mowing. I'm uh, sorry, plowing, plowing, and uh, plowing is quite fun. Uh, although there's not really any jobs for it or anything, like you you can't do a contract for plowing, which is kind of like sigh. Oh, by the way, do, should we put the time down to like real time? It is on real time. Last time we had to. Oh, it is. Oh, okay, yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. I'm oh, gonna wait, 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 wait. Uh, sales. Oh yeah. Oh, nothing. What the hell is that? Single row billet planter. Oh. Really? There's a billet. That's for sugarcane. Um, uh, sugarcane. Yeah. Wow. What is this? The Dalbo Maxi Cut. Oh, that's the uh, mulcher. We have that on our farm. Oh, yeah, yeah, we do. Wait, what am I adjusting here? Oh yeah, you can uh, adjust the width. I didn't know that. Yeah. Well, now I know. You can do it for the other side too. I knew about like the... I knew you could do the... Um, what do you call it? The windrowing, but I didn't know you could extend the... I didn't know you could do that. Uh. -uh. Well, sometimes, Rick, it comes down to the more you know. Yeah. True. Uh, how do I you turn know, this on again? You know what we need for this game at some point? Probably like a double set of mowers, double set of um, balers, two auto loaders. Okay, I'm gonna drive slow. Oh, we're gonna make a lot of money, brother. From this Ooh, silage. Yeah. Once we can finally sell these bales. Oh, we, can, we can probably buy two big tractors from that. Maybe even. But we also need to pay back our loan. Yeah, I think we'll put maybe one tractor and the rest into the loan. Yeah. I mean, at least we know we can make a great amount of money from silage. True. We got five towers of um, wrapped bales here. <laughs> Can you auto windrow with the mower setup? Yeah, it's kind of doing it automatically. It's not 
it's not the biggest windrow. We, we still windrow after doing this because it just makes it a little easier for the baler, but we're in no hurry. Oh, I noticed we have $10,000. Wonderful. Thank you, loan. Yeah, if Harry starts a YouTube Shorts channel, I'll kill him. <laughs> YouTube Shorts about this date. Dates. Okay, actually, that would probably... He would never do that. Oh, no, but that would be great. A TikTok on his date. Oh, that that's why he, his dates keeps walking away. TikToks. Ah, Jaren Gray. Thank you very much for becoming a little raptor. Welcome aboard. Enjoy all the new perks. Don't forget to jump on the Discord. Thank you very much for all the support. Oh man, we got we gotta do so much more right now. Actually, while I'm waiting, I'm actually gonna check out the fields we lost built. See how um, much that's grown. Okay. Well, I think we mowed all three at the same time, didn't we? Uh, no, we bought that other field later. Oh. Oh yeah, we can't we can't mow this field yet. But that still means we will probably double our um, silage. Nice. 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 Uh, I'd wish you could pay for a year membership. I'd be so down. I think you can do that. Um, I think there's an option for your memberships where you can uh, buy a yearly membership or you can set it to auto renew if you'd like as well. Uh, I think if you click or tap see perks, you might be able to upgrade your membership or like click your current tier and then do that. Something like that. Uh, YouTube does a bad job of explaining it, but I think you can. Oops. Any tips for doing silage efficiently in single player? Uh, Rick, any idea? Uh... I mean, I guess I did it. Honestly, yeah. In this map, pretty much alone. Just same, I guess. Take There's time not off really work. Any way to do it better?
I don't think I own that little corner, so it didn't cut. <laughs> Farming simulator should have wolves and bears? No. Oh, Raptor, there's a little shed next to the farmhouse that says it's the farmhouse. And you can sell it for 174000 That's my house, bro. I live there. Here, so I'm going to check that out. Actually, if we sell the farmhouse, we won't be able to sleep anymore. Yeah, but it's little... Yeah, it's next to the farmhouse. Oh, just the shed? Oh. I'm actually gonna see him curious what that I think it's the little means. shed next to the uh, cow pasture, maybe. Uh, next to. Oh wait, he says the shed next to the farmhouse. I think that's where we're parking our vehicles. That's only 27k though. Oh. It's on the left of the house if you're looking at it. Okay, uh, there is like a little wood pile. That's all one building. That's the house. Oh. Um, I mean this the little thing? tent. The tent the is a little yellow tent. The tent is 175,000? Apparently. No, I can't. There's no option to delete it. No, uh, sell. Hmm. You click on it. Yeah, for some reason, my mouse is weird. Uh, it says farmhouse, but. Yeah, it's not a farmhouse because the farmhouse actually has, like, the proper picture at it. Hmm. Questions: Do you want to sell it? Uh, probably not. Oh, this I thing. Mean, uh, it's like the little. Um, hold on. Let me walk over to it. It's uh, where I'm standing now. The that I can't even sell that. Yeah, I can. One hundred seventy-five, apparently. Wow. We can try it, but you might want to save before we do that. Okay. Just in case. Have you saved? Uh, I'm doing it now. Okay. Alright, go ahead. Wow. Actually worked. Wow. <laughs> Wow. Who would ever look? You wouldn't even think that that would be more more than a hundred dollars. Wow, how, all that for the swing set? Alex's swing set? Ah, uh, he grew up. <laughs> oh, hold on. You know what that means? We can buy the tractor now. Okay. Also means we have an area next to the house to park stuff, but we got plenty of room elsewhere, so. Yeah. Wow. All right, I'm gonna return this tractor back to the store and then actually buy it. Uh, a little spam is fine. I can set an algorithm up. Is 
I wonder if they'll ever patch that out. That seems like a plastic slide in a little tent. 175,000? I don't think so. Yeah, it seems like it seems like it's glassed as the farmhouse for some reason. It's weird. Well, whatever. Okay, well, now we got the money. Seven Days to Die Alpha 20 is coming today. Oh, Jessica B will probably be playing that then. She's been playing Seven Days to Die a lot. Oh, yeah. Yeah, classic Rick. We get 175,000. Immediate tractor. But to be fair to Rick, we needed to operate. Like, we, we, we literally need another one. Another one. We do, because... Like, it, it, while I'm mowing, Rick's going to need a bigger tractor to haul that giant windrower we got. And then the baler, and then the auto loader. Like, it's just going to require another tractor. Yeah, I guess the local government paid us a subsidy for, like... <laughs> I guess there's like a, uh, they're banning children now, so. Well, I guess maybe we sold it to the neighbors for a high price. Yeah. Well, it's one hell of a deal for a swing set. Imagine that, chat. You go down to the hardware store and buy like a swing set and a thing for like a couple, maybe a thousand dollars or something. If you buy some really nice stuff, end up selling it for two thousand. Or, uh, sorry, a hundred and, dude, you, you'd, you'd, you'd get a hundred and seventy-four times your investment. That's crazy. We have John Deere's on our other farm. I want to. I want to not get John Deere. I want to see other tractors. Oh, it was gold infused. That's why. Okay. Oh. Maybe it was part of a historic. It was an NFT. It was a swing set NFT. <laughs> there we go. Got a new tractor. Now what do we have? Which. A, a dude's far? Yep. I like that. Wait, did, isn't that the tractor you had last time? Yeah. Oh, cool. Too bad it wasn't and on sale. I got it with a front loader option already, so we can get a front loader onto it uh, when we got some more money. Hey, man, brother, 10 4. Oh, glad. Hey, man, brother, trucker had emote. What's up, G. Vincent? Hope you're doing good, too. Thanks for spreading good vibes in the chat, man. Appreciate that. Why don't we buy a, a newer JD model? Well, what we'll probably end up doing is on the American farm, we'll buy some new John Deere stuff. But since this farm is kind of in Europe, we've been trying to just use European brands. Uh, but the American farm, I definitely want to buy more uh, JD and anything else we can find. How did that windrower get here? Did you drop that off there? Uh, yeah. Huh. I'm, gonna, I'm coming back to the farm now. What track did you use to drop that? Oh, Little Red? Uh, no, the, the tractor actually, um, leased. Honestly, I think the little red can handle that, can it? The wind rower? Uh, not, no, not, not, not really. Not sure. Not on these steep hills. Yeah, we'll do ATS right. when Texas comes out. We'll probably do a multiplayer um, convoy. Actually, we'll do two and two for one. We'll do a we'll do a multiplayer uh, members only stream on the new Texas map. Let's see if we can get everybody on board on that one. Hey, man, brother. I really like the design of the Dutch Far. Yeah, me too. It used to be eh, it used to be really bland, uh, like Dutch Far, Semi, and uh, Lamborghini are like. 
they're pretty much the same tractor. And they used to look exactly the same too. Now they made it so that every of those three brands actually has their own styling. It's really nice. That's a good color for that tractor. Yeah. Wasn't it a class tractor that you get in ca cattle and crops? Yeah. Uh, cattle and crops is just class, I think, and one MB track. Nice. Oh, no, no. no. Uh, you can actually also get uh, Deutsch. Uh, yeah. Have they set a date for the Texas DLC? I don't think so, but um, it'll be the next one that they release. So, you know, TM soon. Uh, yeah, we're working our way up to the uh, big mowing equipment. We just need money. It's all part of farming, Sim, is the grind. Yeah. yeah. I don't own that corner, so I can't mow that. How many bales are we going to get on this field? Uh, I think this field was like somewhere between 24 and 34. If we get a cross roller in the future, we can get more. Yeah, when we use the big crone, we're probably going to use that on like a... We'll, we'll probably end up buying a farm field and just doing a big flat uh, grass field. That way we can zip along and fertilize and... Or at least do it easier. Yeah. These grasslands are okay for now. It's all good, bro. To hear me, my glorious Dutch accent now. Because <laughs> Harry isn't here. Or, Her or um, Raptor's glorious Dutch accent. Yes. Yeah, Raptor, you're Dutch, right? Uh, well, the Dutch love me, it seems. Ah, the, the Dutch love everyone. Get the Belgians. Ah, also the Belgians. Well, this tractor is pretty good on horsepower in this territory. I'm I'm just going slow on purpose uh, to make sure I get close to the edges. We'll speed it up here in a little bit, but making sure we cut as much of the grass as possible at a slower speed is a little, a little more important than going and doing it quickly. We're making silage, so it is a long process. Well, first we mow, then we windrow, then we bale, then we uh, wrap, then we auto stack. Then we got to drop it off at the uh, animal trader. And then we got to let it sit there till January. This is an awesome chill game. I got it this weekend. Oh, good. It's a good game.
Is this game free to play? Uh, no. But it is definitely worth every penny. Especially with the amount of mods that will be... Well, that are out now and that will probably be coming soon. This game will be more and more worth it as time goes on because more mods will be added, more free stuff will be added and free content updates, and uh, there'll be tons of new maps and stuff that the community will make as well. The uh, community is pretty crazy with the amount of stuff that they put into it, so... If you think about it, like games like uh, ATS and Euro Truck uh, are like... For the amount of content that you can download for free, it's like literally couple of pennies for the amount of time and free stuff that you can put in there. Now this game just came out so it's a little on the steeper side but uh, I don't know. I mean if you're going to get into farming sim I think this is the best one to get into. There's still a lot of things that I think they want to add uh, more to. How do you get the mowing so perfect? I mean it's it's okay. Um, practice but also maybe a good controller. I'm using an Xbox controller and I just got a little bit of practice of zipping around with the mower. Alright, uh, while I'm waiting for you, I'm just going to get the bailer ready to go to a first pass. Sure. Thank you, Jaron, for watching. Appreciate the support. Is this game hard to play? Um, kind of hard to figure out what to do, I guess, if you're playing for your first time. I would definitely recommend maybe watch a few getting started videos, but... I wonder, Raptor, if you enjoy I like doing this in first person, there is a setting you can turn on to make your screen uh, bob along with the... With the what? Like, you know how the seat goes up and down? Yeah. Uh, there's a camera setting that you can actually turn it on so your camera will follow the seat. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, it's... Might... Oh, it might actually be under... Um... Graphics. Don't do that in the game. Oh no, there. It's on the camera and general settings. Indoor camera suspension. Alright, let me try that. Okay. You love the Meta, uh, Meta War videos? Well, thanks for watching. Well, let's see how this works. That's pretty cool, I guess. Yeah. 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 Uh, we started playing this particular game, uh, when it uh, about the Friday before it came out, or something along those lines, but um, yeah, we've been playing farming since since I've been playing since 2013, which means I probably got it in 2012, maybe.
How am I? I'm doing good. Thanks for asking. Yep, Farming Sim 22 is uh, just as good or even better than 19 if you think about all the mods that will eventually come to that as well. Looks better, feels better. You know, general improvement overall. But if you like Farming Sim, you're going to love this game too. You're subscribed to the channel? Thank you, Tanya. Thanks for seven. Is this the biggest mower? Uh, I think this is the biggest mower attachment, but there's uh, uh, this one for massive. nine meters or ten meters. Oh, well, there, there's there's a uh, all-in-one like vehicle mower vehicle. The Department of Mower Vehicles. Oh, we're starting to make bales. Nice. Yeah. Well, thank you, Cypher, for watching. Yeah, we're playing with the controller. Yep. Yes, indeed. Uh, thanks, Pat. Rodrigo, hello there. Good to see you.
Oh yes, this is a multi-cross platform, so not only is it available on Xbox and PlayStation and PC, but you can also play all of them together. So if you have a friend on PlayStation and you have PC, you guys can totally play together no problem. Good stuff. Yeah. Not many games do that. Could do it more. Yeah, we'll do some more uh, Men of War and Call to Arms and other games like that soon. Now we're getting there. We're almost done. Almost yeah. done. Well, after this, we got one more field to mow, right? Oh uh, yeah. I, I mean, if we if we got another one ready, yeah. I think probably the other one that um, that you did last time in one go. Yeah, I'll mow this one and then the other one, and then we can work together to bail and yeah wrap. Yeah, we can go a little faster now. What game is this? Fortnite 3. Going into lurk mode. Okay, then. 10-4, brother man. Amen. Yeah, this game's on Steam. Or, you could always get it using the code Raptoria. Check out on the Epic Game Store via the Support a Creator program.
All right, we're getting there. Alrighty, I'm going back to Windrun. Almost there. All right. Uh, you bought the largest field on the French map. Think you'd be great having a freshly plowed. Now you got to pick rocks all day. Oh boy! Always fun to get started with those projects, though. Upgrading that yield—that's probably the most fun—is starting with a somewhat decent field, but then upgrading and having to make improvements over time. Oh yeah, for people wondering if they can run games, there's always the can you run it site. Oh yeah, that's true. Um, it was a real, it, it was a real godsend for me when when I had a much weaker PC. How does that work? You type in your equipment, and then it'll tell you what games you can run, or vice versa. Um, basically can download a little installer oh. uh, that checks for all your system specs and it will say if you can uh, if you meet the minimum specs so you don't even need to know a lot about computers in order to find out if you can run a certain game wow Do you have to fertilize the grass fields? You don't have to, but you'll get more yield for doing it. When we buy some bigger fields, we'll do it that way. Yeah, we can get uh, grass rollers for that. Can we get a WoW emote? Um... Well, I guess you guys could always do the W Wendy's W. Chat, chat gets creative, I can see. Art, arts and chats. 
going on in the chat. I'm using an Xbox controller, just a standard Xbox controller. It's actually pretty good. Um, you can also use like a PS4 controller, I suppose, and uh, just you know use plug and play via Steam or whatever. But uh, Xbox feels really good. Uh, a lot of people like to use steering wheels and such too, and that's totally fine if you're going to be spending a lot of your time in a tractor. But uh, you will still, it, it might still be a good idea to have a mouse and keyboard if you go to build something. It's a lot easier to like decorate and stuff with a mouse and keyboard. Yeah, it's a little harder to do your decoration with the steering wheel. I mean, you can try. You can probably do it if you're determined enough. Yeah, it's probably possible, but always a good idea to have a keyboard on standby, or at least within reach. What are the farms that you have in the game? Uh, well, we have a dairy farm. <laughs> and we have an American farm, too. We were just on the American one earlier. Erica. Yeah, this game feels improved over the last one, for sure. I wonder if we can get all of this done before your next stream, even. Uh, well, probably not, because I'm going to have to take a little uh, break to do some other project I'm working on. Oh, yeah. That'll be in like an hour. we got plenty oh, well. of time. Yeah. Well, we, at we least can... I have plenty of time to mow. Yeah. And we can uh, finish all of this the next time we stream this. True. We got plenty of time. Plus, everybody who's watched today's stream, everybody, 100% of everyone, has smacked the like button. So we, we know that they'd like to see more. And that they don't want YouTube to take away the like button either. But, we'll see. Won't we chat? Hmm. 
Looks nice. Oh boy. Oh boy. Wrong? Oh, nothing. Oh, okay. Just getting ready for the mow. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, we have some of the older bales here still. Oh yeah. <laughs> And it begins. The final mow operation. Mow we need to pressure wash? They certainly do. After we're done mowing, we, we'll clean the equipment. We usually do anyway. It's a lot easier to clean. Yeah. After a mow. This game is really cool. I love the atmosphere. Yeah, I think it's oxygen based. But maybe nitrogen and some other stuff in there. Carbon. It's pretty cool, I guess. Alright, I'm gonna go back to bay like this field. Well, Harry must be out on a date. Yeah. He hasn't come back for a while. The the lad of Pog is nowhere to be found. Except for maybe right over here or something like that. But, uh, you know. I don't know, did he say he was going out of a 32-year-old? No idea. Uh, I heard him say something about 32 and I was just... <laughs> I have no idea.
Oh, she was in her thirties. <laughs> He's lying. Oh uh, yeah, um, if you if you hit another vehicle, it doesn't. I don't think it does anything to the maintenance. Maintenance is just based on wear and tear of how long you've used it. It it would feel feel a bit odd, yeah, if he was going out of a someone in her thirties. I mean, it can happen, but. How old Harry is? Um, how old was he again, Raptor? 17. 17, oh yeah. He's been here playing farming sim with us since he was eight. We let him into a stream. He was really excited to play, so I was like, yeah, alright, come on in, kid. He's after the Raptors doctor. <laughs> Maybe. He's just jealous. Hmm. Yes, I. You're probably right, Chad. Harry probably is jealous of my hair. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we got a bail on the way. Nah, just mow over it. <laughs> okay. Have I noticed that vehicles need to be repaired more often? Um, I've noticed that it's a little misleading because if you have a piece of equipment on your tractor, it'll look like your tractor needs the repair, but not the the attachment that you... Well, I wish it would show the vehicle maintenance and not the uh, equipment maintenance. It's cool that there's maintenance, though.
Oh, well, we're getting there. Yeah. Yeah, we might be able to have all this done in an hour. Yeah, maybe. You have to go at like the half hour mark for a bit. Did you finish so, uh, all the wind rowing? Yeah, I finished the wind rowing in this field. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I probably will miss the end of the stream, but I'm thinking I actually might make the next. I hope you do, brother man. Yeah. Uh, I think, Rick, when you do maintenance at the repair shop that you can buy, is it a cheaper cost? I think so. I'm not 100% sure. No. Yeah. Yeah, plus repair shops, you can switch stuff on your vehicles for free, too, once you buy them. Like tires, for example. Oh, we're cutting grass. Big old grass piles. Oh. oh. Okay. I thought Don't freak paint, though, at your own repair shop. Uh, yeah, but it's costly, isn't it? Or no? Uh, no, you can't, actually. Oh. That's sad. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can. Uh, yeah, you can make silage from grass. Yeah, that's what we're doing. It's pretty cool, brother. Amen, brother. You want to see what Uthras would build in Valheim with unlimited resources? It's uh, pretty impressive. He makes a big o everything. Alright, so at this point we can consider Poglad MIA. Yep. Possibly dead. Been uh, eaten by a cougar. That's not uh. what he said, Rick. <laughs> Yes, all the farming systems are multiplayer. Yes, I'm using a controller to drive and a keyboard to operate certain things. Oh wait, the middle mower went up. Yeah, the um, the harvest from the other day was good. We'll be doing some more stuff on the weekends. Uh, that actually reminds me of... Um, I was talking to a, a Dutch farmer who moved to America ages ago. Uh, Canada, I mean even. And he just casually told me like, Yeah, we one time we uh, just didn't really have anything to do. So we lined up all um, all harvesters we had, which were like, I don't know, 60 or something. And basically they did an entire giant field in uh, one stroke. Wow. All next to each other. Uh, yeah, we'll probably do some more logging streams in the future. That might be a good member stream. We just can't do anything small scale, otherwise it crashes the game.
Hey, uh, Chad, did you guys get anything good on the Steam sale, by the way? I'm looking to buy some new games. What, What is one game from, like, the last two years that you guys would recommend that's on the Steam sale? What genre? Any that you find fun. Whatever, like, the first one, two, or three games to come to mind are. I see a lot of cool games already. Oh, yeah, gas station simulator soon. That's everything. Me? Oh, not really. Okay. Car Mechanic 21? I think it was actually 22, wasn't it? Whatever the newest one is, yeah, we played that. That's good. Oh, The Ascent? Ah, I really like that game. It's very fun. Very pog, very loud. Any bear games? No. Maybe Hunter Call of the Wild. What about Farm Sim 22? We should play that sometime. Oh, yeah. I've heard that's really good. Yeah, Farm Sim's a lot of fun. Yeah. Hey, you, you keep saying that you should play it. Yes. <sighs> Let's play. Oh, yeah. Do it right now. Yeah, we'll play the new Kerbal when it comes out. That'll be exciting.
Alright, I'm nearly done with the bells on this field. Okay, then we just need to windrow the other one. Yeah. And bail. And wrap. Nice. Alright, so you're doing bailing, Rick? So I should probably do yeah. wrapping then, right? Yeah. Um, or wind drawing. Oh, wind drawing, okay. Wait, but you're done with... Oh, I'll do it at the other field, okay. Yeah. Uh, the wind drawer is on the middle of this field, by the way. Then you can just grab the little red one for the baler, because that thing takes nothing at all. Uh, the baler actually takes a decent bit. The baler? It doesn't need yeah. a PTO, though. I mean the wrapper. Yeah, the bell wrapper. I've done it with the red oh, tractor. Yeah. I I thought you, I I was thinking you meant the baler. I was like, yeah, that thing needs a lot of power, but yeah, the wrapper, the little tractor could probably handle. There we go. That's going to make us some money. Ah.
Yeah, the wind rowing won't take too long. Oh, the newest Age of Empires game? I don't think that's on sale because it's new, but it is a good game. Age of Empires 4 yeah. was a lot of fun. The campaign's cool. Lots of uh, little extra history tidbits and stuff in there. Very um, educational game. Learned a lot from that one. Love it. 10 out of 10 would play the campaign again. Well. Mo money, mo problems. Well, you, you can have rival farms, yeah. If you want to do a competing farm with a friend or a few friends, you can do that. Set up uh, kind of separate bank accounts. And then go off and buy land and build uh, stuff on your property. It'd be cool to see a, a dedicated server on all the time and see uh, farms development. Oh, yeah. But I really want them to make a blank map where it's like uh, they give you a few spaces to build homes and like terrain and then you have to build it within that space. These always seem to be a little pre-generated. Oh, you got a dedicated server working? Yeah, if you guys ever want to advertise your dedicated servers for any game or whatnot, or if you're playing Minecraft or whatever, if you ever want to use the Discord for anything, even for your own YouTube channels, feel fine. And uh, welcome. How about doing that? Nothing wrong with you guys hanging out on the Discord doing that. For everybody. A lot of cool people on the Discord. Exclamation point Discord.
Nice. Nice. Very nice. Uh, it's a cold, rainy Monday, and you want to stay inside watching me? Ah, good. Well, you can always watch the VOD afterwards. Although being here live is a little bit more fun, because then you can spam lowercase k's, and f's and g's, and kfc's, and wendy's emotes, and or click or tap join to become a member, so that way you don't uh, miss out on extra perks like uh, extra giveaways and uh, extra hangouts in the members section. And also... Um, members only live streams where you guys can come and play along with us like for example this Saturday that type of thing just as an example Where's that bailer, Rick? Uh, it's behind me. Oh, you're bailing right now? Okay. Yep. All right, time to start bailing and uh, wrapping. All right. Did you finish bailing, Rick? Uh, I'm getting close. Nice. Yo, Captain Kiwi with the big O10. Thank you very much for the support. Woo! Thank you. Been watching all your F streams, loving the series, even though it's a 5 a.m. NZT wake up call for me. Well, thank you very much for watching. Who's in the game with me? It's Rick today. Harry was here earlier, Hi. but we'll uh, we'll probably not see we'll, him for the rest of the day. We'll miss him. But Rick will be back later for our Icarus stream, which I'm sure everybody here will tune in for, right, guys? No. Okay. Well, at least you're honest. Uh, I bet Chat will, will uh, tune in because there are bears. No. Oh. Chat lost bears. Alright, nearly done bailing. See, Ashley will be there for the bears. 
Well, we gotta talk, uh, because we gotta remember this Icarus mission that you were on last time, it, it completes a little bit differently in this game. We'll probably need you to, like, log back into the old, uh, prospect and just, like, you'll have to launch back up into space so you can join us for this next mission. Oh, okay. So, like, for you, we, we completed it, so, like, you'll get the bonus and stuff, but... Oh, okay. The only thing you won't get is, like, the XP from, like, you know, like, mining and cutting down trees and stuff, but you can do that any time. Yeah. Like, it's all, it's all about the grind. Still less grind than Elite Dangerous. <laughs> uh, maybe. They look like dominoes now that tipped over. <laughs> oh, yeah, they kind of do. All right, bailing is done. Are uh, the repairs low on the trailer or the tractor? Uh, it's probably the the forklift part. We use these forks a lot, but it's okay. Repairs are very expensive, so it's like you gotta kinda pick and choose what you repair. Wrong button. Uh, from what we understand, uh, damage has effect on top speed, I think, for certain things. Like, didn't you guys test that out, Rick, with that um, sprayer? Yeah. What did you I'm find out? I'm pretty sure once it was damaged that the sprayer went much slower. I'm. I think we can probably get at least two stacks of bales from this bit uh, already. That's well, great. If this field alone has two stacks, that brings us up to seven. Six or seven, yeah. Hello chat, I see you. And don't be afraid of saying hi in the chat too if you're new around here. Would love to see you.
I had three more bells and then I'm full. Oh really? Okay. Yep. What will you say is the longevity of this game? Well, I mean, honestly, people are still playing 2019 because of all the mods and other things to do in that game, so... Hey, you can play this for as long as you want. It'll take uh, lots of time. Was that your last one, Rick? Yep. What's up, Baron VC? How you doing? Good to see you, JDM. Oops. Stack number six. Going down. Up. Good. Nice. Well, if this makes if this makes us half a million dollars, that'll be great. Oh yeah. I think it will. Last time I got three seventy five, and that was like uh, I think a quadruple stack. Half a million dollars. I took pay our loan back right away. We're gonna do this a few times before. It we sell, so we're probably gonna end up with like oh, we're probably gonna end up with like ten stacks down there. Oh yeah. Oh, we're gonna be we're gonna be working so long to sell all of it, but it'll be worth it. I think so too. Oh, we have two tractors now that can handle front loaders, so uh, speed up the process. Uh, what's the mod to pick up any weight pallets? Uh, I'm not sure. Well, I mean, there's a game setting where you can pick up any pallet, right? There? Maybe not by hand, but I, I don't know if there's a weight restriction on that. There might be a game mode for it. Can't remember, brother. Remember, brother, I cannot.
Boom. Ooh, there's like four in a row right here. Oh, yeah. We're making Christmas presents, chat, for all of you good little members. Yeah, eggs are a really good way to make money, yeah. All right, there are like at least two more stacks on this field. <laughs> More than a thought, actually. Fantastic. How many more do you need? Uh, two more now. Oh, we'll go over here. Is grass still the most profitable crop? Well, it all depends on what you're doing, you know. Everything comes down to yield and... favorite all-around tractor in this game um the john deers are fun the mccormick man that's a hard question they're all they're all good it depends on like what you know mood you're in in the game for a job to do so like if you're going to be doing some bailing it's really nice to bring a high horsepower tractor sometimes it's nice to use a nimble tractor like this one like small isn't necessarily bad all right i'm full Amen, brother. Oh. <laughs> yeah, true. Technically, you can keep playing this game forever, really. I'm sure there's some, some people out there still playing 17 and 15 and... Oh, most likely, yeah. I would say 13, but probably not. About 11. But this one's probably the best for the crossplay and such. Because now you can get the most amount of people together with the least amount of investment. Yeah. So if you're a gamer on a budget, you don't have to worry about breaking the bank too much to buy this game and also get it on console and play with a friend. What am I looking forward to more? Company Heroes or Meta War 2? Um. Hmm. Probably Men of War 2. I want to see more about what they've done with that game. Because I haven't played it yet. I've only played Company of Heroes 3 uh, beta test or whatever. And it, it played fine. I like it. But I want to see... Those are two kind of different games as well. How much do you pay the NPCs uh, per month and day? Are you talking about in the chat? 
Uh, everybody here is a paid bot. That is true. Like, maybe one or two accidental viewers get in, but for the most part, everybody here is paid bot. Uh, confirm with... Bots, confirm with 1010. Yeah, and he doesn't pay me anything. <laughs> but yeah, the bots... Uh, I, we haven't really used them much, but... Honestly, in this series, we haven't used them at all. Yeah, like, accidentally. I don't even know how smart they are. I, I can't really comment on the NPCs. I've always had the boys on, because we've all been really liking it. Yeah. Nice. Nice. That's a nice line of bills. Yeah, that's five for you. Almost half full already. What's up, Mr. Swede? Good to see you in the chat. Yeah, Rick's here. I don't know about Morty. I haven't seen him. Jordan K with the two months as a raptor egg. Thank you very much. Welcome. All that big O support. Thanks, Jordan. Now we're playing with a controller. How many more do you need, Rick? Uh, four.
You're looking at getting a steering wheel for the game. Would you prefer a controller or a steering wheel? Uh, I mean, I'm liking the, the controller just for the different things to do, but... Uh, yeah. It kind of depends on what you're going to be doing the most. Yeah, I mean, you could definitely play with a controller, keyboard, and a steering wheel. Depends on how you set it up on your desk. Yeah, we're going to do a uh, Saturday setup. Big O stream on Saturday for members again. So we'll figure out another big 16 person project to do. Rick, where do we got more uh, bales over there? Got them. Did you miss the dairy? Well, we're kind of working on that farm right now. We're doing silage, which is on the dairy farm. One of the things we plan to do to get more money in order to get more uh, cattle. Sheep too. Oh, are you full? Yeah, uh, I'm full and I gotta go for now. Okay, <laughs> bye. Oh, I'll see you in an hour. An hour. Yeah. Yeah. Goodbye, okay, Rick. No chat, there's not bears in this game. Uh, why is the wrap black? Uh, when you make it, you can, when you buy it, you can like customize it to be any color you want. There's green, black, pink, and uh, white. I think white's probably the easiest because you can see it much easier in a field. But I don't know why. I, I guess Rick chose black just to mix mix it up a little bit. But the uh, it's hard to tell whether or not a bale has been wrapped that way. Well, let's see if Chad can get to 500 likes in the next... 30 seconds. Let's see if a few people will reach out and tap that button and let us know they'd like to see more farm sim on the channel. That'd be nice. Well, I'm sure there's more bales. Yep, I see one over there. Let's see if chat can get to 550. No possible way. Pretty close, but uh, that's not going to happen. There's no way. That's a lofty goal. No way. But close. All right, there's probably like three or four more bales out here somewhere. So what we'll do is we'll we'll deliver this wagon out there with 14 bales down to the animal trader, and then we'll come back and get any other bales that are missing. There's probably like another seven, seven to ten bales, and then we'll go to that other big field and do that sometime in the future. 
It's going to be it for our farm sim stream here today for our American farm and our dairy farm. This one being our dairy farm and our American one being earlier in the stream. So thanks again for smashing like on the way out. We'll see you guys in an hour for Icarus, another farming survival uh, game that uh, is out now. So I'll see you guys in an hour for that one. And then uh, I'm going to go do some other recordings and get some other stuff done for you guys for tomorrow. Thanks again for watching, you guys. Thank you very much for uh, subscribing, turning on the notification bell, and never missing a stream. Uh, definitely is a great way to support, as well as clicking and tapping join and becoming a member. Thanks again for all the new memberships today. Thanks for all the big O super chats. And thank you very much for being awesome in the chat. We'll see you in about an hour for our next stream. Thanks again for dropping by. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye, everyone.